Isaac and his mother lived alone in a small house on a hill. Isaac kept to himself, drawing pictures and playing with his toys as his mother watched Christian broadcasts on the television. Life was simple and they were both happy. That was until the day Isaac's mom heard a voice from above. Your son has been corrupted by sin. He needs to be saved. I will do my best to save him, my lord, Isaac's mother replied, rushing into Isaac's room, removing all that was evil from his life. Again, the voice called to her. Isaac's soul is still corrupt. He needs to be cut off from all that is evil in this world and confess his sins. I will follow your instructions, Lord. I have faith in thee, Isaac's mother replied, as she locked Isaac in his room away from the evils of the world. One last time, Isaac's mom heard the voice of God calling to her. You've done as I've asked, but I still question your devotion to me. To prove your faith, I will ask one more thing of you. Yes, Lord, anything, Isaac's mother begged. To prove your love and devotion, I require a sacrifice. Your son Isaac will be this sacrifice. Go into his room and end his life as an offering to me to prove you love me above all else. Yes, Lord, she replied, grabbing a butcher's knife from the kitchen. Isaac, watching through a crack in his door, trembled in fear. Scrambling around his room to find a hiding place, he noticed a trap door to the basement hidden under his rug. Without hesitation, he flung open the hatch just as his mother burst through his door and threw himself down into the unknown depths below. What's going on? It's time for me to wake up and do a stream, huh? The sound will be distinct to your right. I'll fix. I forgot about that. It's from AI Arena last night. Well, not last night, but. Should be fixed now. I went ahead and unlocked the key, the knife thing there. There it is. Um, do I have to do it on every character? Damn. That's gonna be tough. Oh man, I didn't realize that was the case. Oh man, that's gonna suck. Merry Christmas, Bishop. I have not tried this character yet. Here it's tough. I'll do that in a minute. Uh. Shit, I got a lot of work to do if that's the case. I didn't realize I had to beat the, the additional content with every character. That's gonna be hard. That boss down there is rough. Uh, I'm inclined to say that we should play Bethany and Jacob in this hell. J before we do the challenges, just because doing them to the chest or to... Um, Dark room will be easy, easier anyway, and it should unlock a whole bunch of stuff. On the bright side, the key is permanently unlocked. All I have to do is go through the area to get it, so that part's done. The puzzles are solved. I just have to do it a million times. I gotta do it, what, ten times? Eat? Okay. I'm gonna play Bethany on hard mode. Bethany is very good. She can't use soul hearts, which is pretty... That's the downside, no soul hearts. But honestly... Let me just show you a screenshot before I even get started of the ideal Bethany build. I was watching my buddy play and he found the menorah. I wonder if I have a screenshot of it actually. 
<laughs> that music, I couldn't tell if it was echoing or not. It's not. Okay, here's one. I put it on Discord. So here is... <clears throat> she's maxed out fire. Each one of those flames shoots. He's got 16 of them, I think. 14 or 16 shots per shot. And also, he's got the menorah maxed out. And those flames protect him from bullets and enemies, so he's never going to get hit. So he has seven shots, normal shots, on top of the 16 that that thing's shooting. Every time he fires, he fires 16 plus 7. The 16 don't scale, but they still do one damage each or something like that. And then he fires seven regular huge polyphemous shots there, just because that's what he had. That's how good this character can become. She can't get soul hearts though. He's never going to get hit, so it doesn't matter. Not with that rolling like that. That's what I was watching. So I'm gonna go ahead and just use them as I get them, since you do not lose them unless you get them hit. So you have to protect them, which isn't the easiest thing in the world there. I just took a hit on one already, because they're pretty big. Your hitbox is quite large when they're out. But, you know, do our best to do that. Do not want them to take damage. That's absolutely not the ideal. If I can get a battery, any kind of recharge item, or a soul heart generator, <clears throat> that'll help a lot. So she can't get soul hearts, they're used as battery power instead, so that's how you max this out. And as long as the flames don't die, I can keep on making more until I hit 16. So every two rooms I will make one immediately. I'll grab that and see if it helped us out. It gave me damage. Well, that was a good experimental treatment. The fabled good experimental treatment does exist. This music rules and I'm gonna buy it. I'm gonna buy whoever made it. He's gonna get some money from me for it. I'm going in deep with the one health. Because I don't see why not. I don't think I'm gonna take any hits for a while here. Not with this kind of guard. I might, but you never know. An enemy like that is the one that would get me too, the one that jumps right through. I lost the fire! No! Not doing too hot at saving them. Gotta protect them better. Once this really starts rolling, I think it's easier to protect them all, even though you have a ton. It's easier just because you're putting out such a wall of damage. Man, they're all tiny and screwed up. I think they're also spectral. They are. They're so good. They're spectral tears. They go through this wall. My, my regular shot doesn't even do that. You can't say enough good things about this mod. Yeah, it's really good does everything right. Lots of good decisions. Not very many items that are bad. I, I don't really like bad items much. I don't think they should really be in the game. <clears throat> Man, only two bucks? What a scam. Here's my spectral tier advantage at work right here, man. I do need to, to get to the boss rush, so I can't take forever. I'm taking way too long. I need to get in there. I got 20 minutes to get to Depths 2's boss beat. I've already used three of them on this floor. Bad moves. Get hurry the hell up. Taking 100 years. I'm trying to play it safe with my fire, but I can't afford to do that. I do the, all this damage, I need to take advantage of it and just go. If I don't have max fire, then I just don't have max fire, whatever. We're not going in there, actually, even if we could. My flames! Don't want that.
There we go. That's pretty good, right? I need keys. Maybe I'll go play at the... Eh, I don't know. If I don't have a key at the end of this, I'm still gonna go do it, I guess. I don't know what else to do about it. I gotta get a key somewhere. I don't like not getting my item. Oh, you can see now that it's extended to the second circle. We have nine now. Getting ridiculous real fast here. That's good. But I do want a key, so I'm gonna go gamble, I guess. There's no other way for me to get one, so... My best choice. <clears throat> oh shit, I walked too fast. <laughs> That's too bad. I just got a small rock too. Oh well. That's what I get for sitting on one health. I'm gonna have to get used to the um, confusing nature of um, nine things spinning around me. Also, I just woke up. Give me a break. <laughs> Man, she's so good out the gate with this triple shot. These things are as strong as she is at the start. They're not very good later on, but man, they certainly give her an early game, and I have no reason to go slow with this. So I don't think getting to the boss rush with her will be a problem. I haven't even tried the other guy. I hear he's awful. This gimmick kicks ass. I hear the other one's a split in half gimmick, and it's ridiculous. <clears throat> we'll see. It didn't look very good. <laughs> I don't know if I like that guy. That is not a good move. There's some spacebar items that I might prefer over these flames. These flames are really good, but I mean, when you have soul heart regenerating spacebar items, there's quite a few. I've never seen this before. Slice but no dice. I don't know what that does. I think it slices the enemies in half, but I don't know what the advantage of that is. <clears throat> I ain't gonna use it. I'm busy. The ability to convert all your hearts into um, a spacebar item, though. There's some seriously overpowered spacebar items that you could get around uh, the cooldown of and really fuck up people with. I really need a bomb, but that's okay, whatever. Yuck. My power is not very good right now. They keep hitting my fire. <clears throat> I didn't get any soul hearts at all. I gotta fight Haunt with nothing, basically. She's got really bad movement speed. Feels like Maggie. I really don't like that. I don't know why they gave her that slow speed. Yeah. Man, without that fire though, she's really bad. I really need to not lose those, and I need to get some soul hearts too. Just didn't find any. No charge at all. Can't be helped. If you don't get more than a couple at once, you're never gonna get them taken off. Dent oil. Oh, Mass, what's going on? 21 months. Bethany. Just trying her out. Haven't really played her much. Did the challenge for her already. So that's done, but uh, <clears throat> need to win with her on boss rush, and I need to do chest and um, the other thing. Ah, damn it! I was close.
There were complications. But she's alright. They had to do a C-section. And then she was bleeding all day. But, uh, they're both fine. I bought them a giant ass TV. <laughs> they were happy about that, at least. I can't go in there, because I... I don't remember why I'm at one health. Did I actually die that much? I think I did. I think I just got my ass kicked, and that's why. I didn't actually turn it into money like last time. I just got handed... Got my ass handed to me by haunts. Whoops. Do I want to go in here? I guess so. Both bombs. Well, you have to buy... Antibirth. If you have Rebirth, you have Antibirth. It's mod. It's free. It just uses Rebirth. You don't even need Afterbirth. In fact, you have to uninstall Afterbirth when you install it. There goes my devil deal, but that's alright. I ain't too worried about that. Wish I had a bomb. How you doing, gurgles? The knockback on this is so good that once you have a billion of them... This is why I think that when you get a billion it's easier to protect them than when you have two or three. Because their knockback is so huge. I did get some bombs. Nice! Unless they're all troll bombs. No, they're not good. And we got an angel room. What is this? Oh, I've had this before. This is, um... You know what? Should I kill this guy? I guess I should. Maybe she can't get double deals. Maybe that's another gimmick of hers. I don't know why my flames are black. Why are they black? What did they... What the hell did I do to cause that? Maybe they use black hearts, and if they blow up, they'll blow up as, um... Black heart explosions? That'd be neat. Come on! <laughs> got it. Nice. <clears throat> Afterbirth Plus is not gonna be as good as this, honestly. Dark Twins, I don't know if you're here, but thanks for the auto-host. That's a pretty big auto-host. I figure that you just, uh... I mean, you may as well have hosted me if that's the... <laughs> yeah, you must have just stopped streaming. Duh, my fires. No, they're actually pretty fine, it looks like, but I think I lost one. We're rolling in them right now, man. We are loaded. This is ridiculous. We're gonna burn, burn through these floors here. <clears throat> Duh, my fires. Look at that wave of power, man. This kicks ass. Um, it's really easy to install. You just turn off Afterbirth checkmark on Steam and then run their installer and then you're done. You can turn Afterbirth back on if you want, but they won't use it for this. Oh, uh, this character's the one you get for 12 soul hearts. That one's the one that's listed in the menu, so really easy. Hey, thanks for follows, folks. When my girlfriend finishes waking up, I'll show you my Christmas gifts. I'll turn on my webcam. Maybe I can do that. I bought a bunch of stuff for everybody. They bought me a couple things. I don't think I'm gonna get a god room. Actually, it's uh, you know what? I didn't I didn't know that they had separate percentages. I thought it was always the same, and then it just randomly became one or the other. But wow, that's good. Holy mantle. It's from antibirth.com. If it's up, if it's not, you'll have to get it off Reddit or something. 
I feel like exploring the full floor. I think I have enough time to do that and get the boss rush. With this. Eight minutes on what floor three here is. I can't believe my bot doesn't... I'm gonna fix that right now. It should not be timing out subs. It should be whitelisting you. I can fix that at least. I'm getting my own bot program to moderate the chat and it'll be a lot easier to control its maniac attitude then, but uh... It should be excluding you. I don't know why it didn't. It's broken. Moobot sucks. I hate Moobot. Get a war with you, Moobot. Oh, it didn't time out Callan Zombie. It timed out Sketch 4. Okay, that makes more sense. Sorry. It shouldn't have done it anyway, but um, I was wondering why it timed out him and it didn't. It did its... Per it did its job, I, I guess. Well, I don't want to go in there until I kill the boss because apparently... That lowers your chance for some reason, so I guess we won't do that. Did you see Rats of Prey getting shit on for having notifications on in their YouTube? What a, what a mess. What a whiny community they've got. Slow Beef is um, learning the best practices for streaming, and if he used notifications, it's probably because I told him he should. But I mean, I don't want holy water, so whatever this thing is. Okay, so I can throw a couple shots. That's pretty bad for six charge, it seems like. That seems like it should be a one cooldown, not six. But whatever. I'm not using that. Anyway, um... Oh, you can you can just go through that. Yeah, I guess you could. Yeah, I don't know why I thought you had to do all of them at once. Anyway, if Slow Beef makes a decision... Oh, it recharges in the room. That makes more sense. If Slow Beef made a decision to use, um... Notices like that. It's probably my fault. I probably told him, and I'm right, uh, that it makes a lot of money. And it makes the stream run better, but um, it's definitely not a YouTube audience kind of thing. Unfortunately, YouTube is trash. Not the people watching it, but YouTube in general just doesn't make any money, so since he is doing this professionally, he needs to do that. And if YouTube doesn't like it, YouTube can eat shit. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I think I, I'm gonna tell him. I mean, I told him how he could do it for, and have the best of both worlds. Because you can. I mean, just it's not like a one or the other situation. You can mute them. You can make them tiny. And um, if you put them in the black space that you could easily create on Twitch, since it's not a widescreen game, even even easier then, it would be not too hard to um, hmm, like. I'm trying to explain how I would do it. I would put them in the black space, and then I would crop it out later. And I would have the audio playing on a different track. And when I go to edit the video, I would simply turn that track off. So no one would be the wiser that those alerts are playing on my stream. That's how I do it with Arcade Pit. Uh, when I do do it with Arcade Pit. When I, when I even have those on, because I actually do use... 
notice this for those doing a, a marathon. Normally I do turn them off. Just because I don't like them even for Twitch, interrupting the main show. I was going one idiot. I can't get those. Damn. He's teasing me with soul heart. I lost some of my flames. I'm not doing a very good job guarding them. It seems like a lot of stuff stacks with this so well. Like this, this is pretty good. That screenshot I showed you guys before. I think work better than Menorah because you don't take damage with this. You just do not take damage. You don't need soul hearts because these things guard you so well. So something that's based on you not taking damage is pretty solid. New here? Uh, I, this is a game show channel. A lot of the time, half the week I do game shows. I'm not doing one today, but um, we were supposed to do video game Jeopardy last night, but I didn't. Uh, I had stuff to do. But uh, today's my variety cast day anyway, so I'm probably going to be playing this a lot today. It's a bit early for me though. Yeah, the Minora seems like the best thing you could possibly get on many characters, but for her especially, it seems like it's really good. Oh god, not you. I use this thing I got. This thing here, the circle, this seems really good as well. Its circle is just wide enough to protect me from contact damage a lot of the time. Though I am trying to use it and I'm losing flames because of it. That's a price I'm willing to pay for the speed that I'm going to get from it, because I'm trying to rush to the god for, uh, the devil deal thing. That sucks. That item's terrible. I don't need that. Tears down. Uh. Yeah. YouTubers are. A different audience. It's hard to. Translate one from the other sometimes. For the most part, it's easy. Um, I certainly do. Okay, so for the record, that crappy pill right there, all orange, is tears down. I'll take this. Brimstone boy. Nice. That's a really good pill to find. I hope I can get some more of those, because that's an instant book. Maybe two. I think you get two soul hearts per pickup, so balls of steel is two charges instantly. Amazing. So good. I wonder what the converter does. <laughs> I'm afraid to find out the hard way. I'm gonna run where I am succeeding. Whoops, I shouldn't have bought that. Oh, my bad. Pills. Normally, I'd be all about teleporters. Yeah. Move this, I guess. Yeah, if you are going to give me bits, if you have bits and you want to spend them here, make sure you put charity on. Because that's still a thing. <laughs> Probate single-handedly gave me like $200 worth of charity by giving me 10,000 10, bits the other day. They don't really have that many. I thought they'd get more than they did. So far, they're only like 10k. 
So I've actually contributed a lot to that just because of probate and the other big bits boys came in here. It added up real fast. We've actually put in like four or five hundred dollars worth of charities in this camp in this channel. Like one twentieth across all of Twitch. It seems weird, but I must I must get a lot more bits than most people. Hey Dark Twitch, how you doing? Thanks for the host. I guess I, I I must I must get more bits than most people. If that's the case, it just seems weird. Is that message new? Because that didn't pop up the other day. I hope that we did actually uh, contribute that much to it. That message wasn't popping up before, but it was totally on a couple days ago, right? They said as much. I'm pretty sure it was. Maybe they just added that message recently. I hope that, um... I hope that his bits did go through. I'm pretty sure they said they retroactively added all the bits that happened over the days. Over the last two days. So, I, I'm pretty confident that he made it in. I would hate to hear that he didn't when he, he dropped a thousand dollars of bits on there specifically for the charity. I need to find the item room before I want to bail. Oh no, I'm running out of time. Jeez, I got another floor to go. Oh, I gotta hurry. Okay, there it is. I wasn't paying attention. I've got to burn through depths and depths, uh, depths two right now. Now, I don't even have to get the gold thing down there. I gotta go. I've got a minute and a half basically to do this. I gotta, I gotta find. Um, even if I don't get the items, it doesn't matter. I gotta get this done. I'm taking way too long. This is a good item. We get a ton of luck as long as we don't get hit. And I'm not gonna get hit, I've got the Holy Mantle and a ton of fire guarding me. I need to find the boss now though. That's the wrong way. I'm not gonna be able to optimize this floor because of this. That's the Tears Down pill. No, it's not. Telepills. If I go into another dead end, I'll use that. I can drop the boss and... 15 seconds, I bet, so if I could just get to her in, in that time frame. The fuck is she? Okay, we found her. Yeah, let's go. I'm just gonna skip. We got telepills, we can, we can use them to get out afterwards, so we're good, actually. Fine. Come on, come on. Got it. We are doing the boss rush. We have to do it. Uh, I don't know what that thing is, but I'll pick it up and find out. Is it a battery? Amazing. No, it's some kind of damage pro. Oh, that's kicks ass with luck. That thing that I that I have that uh, it breaks if I take damage. So for now, I've got ten luck. So it's gonna proc all the time that lightning thing. But um, if I get hit, I'm gonna lose a lot of luck. It's gonna be bad. Bad. Oh, that's too bad, small bird. Hope you feel better. I was getting sick for a while there, but I don't... I think I recovered before I really got nailed by anything. I started drinking a lot of vitamin C stuff. I'm glad I found telepills, because, um... I, I don't... I never really understood why. Maybe you know why, Twinge. Is there a good reason why we cannot explore this floor? The only floor we can't explore when we kill the boss? Not even the final boss does that. Why, why mom? Why does she lock you out? Why doesn't it just open the door back up? I don't understand. Why? That is the thing it does, though. Is she dead up there? Yeah, she is. So, so we need a teleport to get out of here after we finish. If we want to explore and pick up all that stuff I skipped. And why the hell wouldn't you? You know. I no longer need to worry about my time, because Hush isn't in this run anymore. He's not in uh, Rebirth, so... We're done with the speediness of this.
I don't think the 9 volt's gonna be is well the 120 volt whatever. I don't, I don't think it's gonna be as good when I when I do eventually lose this luck thing, and I probably will in this since I no longer have my fires with me. They eventually died. Can't last forever when I'm rushing in with this thing. I really want to use this um, godhead circle that I've got naturally. Um, I just took a hit from red poop, I think. So one more and I'm done. I use my holy mantle. <laughs> it's kicks ass. Hey, thousand dollars. Thanks for the bits. So yeah, they are dropping those into charity. Join in on the uh, the bits charity program. I wish they would tell me. Um, I had a schedule that they were doing something like that because my mar my marathon for arcade pit unfortunately was on the 18th. Four days before they launched this major bits charity event, I must have gotten. $5,000 of bits. Like, what the... <laughs> I would have told everybody to just hold up. I would have, in fact, rescheduled my marathon for the 22nd if I knew. Uh, I didn't know, though. We've still given quite a few, but man, if they would just have told me that, I would have... I would have dumped a ton onto that program. The. Oh shit, there it goes. Gish got me. Oh no, I'm gonna die if I don't watch it. Freaking Monstro and Gish. I forget how to fight these two boys. You gotta constantly be moving away because they're both jumping at you all the time. Oh man, they got me again. I really am gonna die in here. That sucks. All of a sudden I'm at risk. And I also have to watch out for the red poops. I forgot about those. These two are just so tanky. Oh, damn it. He got me. He really did. There goes my boss rush attempt. Fuck. I got lucky and got a proc, so I'm just gonna have to try again and get that. That's too bad. Fucking Gish and Monster, man. Can't believe they ruined me by themselves. Those chumps. Chump-ass bosses of all things to beat me, but man, they really shut me down. I just could not get away. I needed to win that. I needed that achievement. I gotta start over. Well, we have to do another run with her anyway, so whatever. We really don't have very many items, to be fair. All we have is this electric proc and uh, this godhead thing. And it's good, but it's not that good. Not against them. It should be easy to get up stronger build. It's been a long time since I've died in the boss rush. And especially to them. I don't think they've ever gotten me. I don't know why. I, I just could not dodge them. They're kicking my ass. On the bright side, see that would have helped a lot there, even just that would have been nice. And what's in here? Black candle, sure. This, sure. This, yeah. This, range up, whatever. I'll drop some money in this. Little Broom's okay, he's not great. He's, he's not the greatest thing in the world, honestly. His damage is not very high. Uh, the red poop enemy is a really big problem for Bosch Rush. Afterbirth doesn't have a lot of good ideas, but it did. It does give you a charge every room clear in the Bosch Rush, so you do get a bunch of charge while you're doing it. You also get no red poops, because that enemy doesn't spawn. Generally. We have no reason not to go in here. Got free keys. You're really gonna see how bad luck is as a stat here. 
as I've lost 10, and you probably won't even notice. 10. The way luck scales in this game is insane. It's way too weak. It's pathetic. As a stat, it's just no good. It's nowhere near as strong as it needs to be. Have I done the boss, uh, the devil deal on this floor? I can't remember. I don't think I did. I don't think I got it. So I think I am going to use this. I'm pretty sure I did not see it. Let's jump in there. I didn't see it. I'm not too thrilled about what's in here, but whatever. If I had explored the floor, if I had time, all that stuff I just got would have sealed that. That would have been easy. Yeah, range is garbage too, but luck... It's, it's funny because if luck was actually a good stat, if they scaled it around you getting maybe 10 instead of you getting 100, a lot of the items that are insanely bad, like common cold, which is nearly worthless, a lot of those proc effect items that you just look at and you say, whatever, this doesn't do anything. It actually would be pretty good. Tooth shot, all those weird things that just aren't that great would suddenly kick ass. The whole game would be better if they would just make luck better as a stat, but they refuse. They want to scale it off 100, and then when you use a luck uphill, you get one. It's ridiculously slow. It's it, the only way you'll ever get good proc rate is by cheating and creating some kind of pill scam. There's no other way. The dead cat. <laughs> I don't think so. You know what? Maybe I should actually do that. Hmm. I have a guppy piece. One guppy piece. I'm doing it. I don't care. I never denied the dead cat. Let's go. I wonder if my flames respawn. <laughs> I seriously doubt I'm ever going to die without my flames, but uh... My flames will die first, I think. Consistently. Well, I think a lot of the problem with the, the game is that a lot of the items are trash, and you could make a lot of them better because a lot of them are proc effects. You can make a lot of them way better. I don't know why you have a stat that doesn't do jack and shit. Why do you need that? There's like three of them. Shot speed? Whatever. That's even worse than range. It's the most <laughs> relevant stat in any game. Okay, we get a free devil deal item even though we're her, and we can't usually get those. I have to be double fallen though. Uh. My fires, they're ruining them. Unfortunately, my uh, godhead effect does not extend beyond the circle that the uh, the big one makes. I'll just hold on to these. I don't think I need to do this stand fight. I think the stat counter is a mod made by somebody who understands stat screen better than the developers. Let me refresh my dashboard. I really hope that they make the dashboard actually update correctly. Like it used to. This new one doesn't do it right. I don't know. It unmutes and auto-plays the video preview, which I hate, because I hear myself talking, and then you guys hear an echo, and then it doesn't- it says I'm offline the entire stream, even though I know I'm not. Hope they fix that. It's really nice otherwise. Yeah, I'm afraid to use- I'm just gonna keep one circle at this point, since I want to use this big circle. Well, I hope they fix it, because this new dashboard is better, I think. I like it better, it's just... It needs to read the information it's advertising properly, and then it would be better. Since it doesn't, it's worse. It's got Twitter built-in and stuff, that's nice, but uh... 
even that is a little screwy because if you tweet with that that you're starting, it's it'll link to the wrong thing and then the video for me at least doesn't play until I close this and that. That battery effect with these. I don't know if it procs on those. I don't think it does. I don't think those flames get my procs, unfortunately. Uh, they don't scale very well. They're very good at the start, but I think they get worse and worse as you go on. Is that kind of stuff? They don't scale with any of the effects. They're not- they'd be ridiculous if they did. Holy shit, would she be overpowered, but... That is the thing I need to keep in mind, is that I'm not getting 10 procs of this 120 volt. I'm just getting the one that I'm creating. Uh-oh. There goes my fires. Thanks. It lives, you jerk. I didn't want those anyway. Soul, baby. This thing's trash. I don't think the stat display is fluff. I think all those stats are pretty good. Uh, it tells you what items do too, which is nice. The only ones up there that... Like, I don't feel like you really need to display shot speed. Which is, um... That's not tier rate. Let's not confuse those two. Tier rate is very important. Shot speed is how fast this moves. And it is the most ignorable stat in the world. It's, It's like pseudo range up. It's just another range up. A second range up. As if range up was not irrelevant enough, they split it into two by giving another stat that makes it... And then there's tier height, which I don't think is even on there. Another range up stat. Conflate it even more. Tier height lets you shoot over obstacles. It's very unlikely that you ever get to take much advantage of that. And that's irrelevant because you can shoot through obstacles with a bunch of power-ups anyway. Range up is the most non-power that exists, unless you're really hurting for it or something, like you must have gotten a bunch of range downs. Uh, to be hurting for it, because nobody starts with bad range. They all are pretty well off. This this circle is absolutely crazy. Now that I can use it freely without worrying about my fire, look how fast everything dies. I'm saving my soul hearts. Not that I have very many, but I am saving them for later on in here. Oh, I can turn the stat screen on and off, too. Let's not forget that. This thing here I don't really like. It's a pseudo-item tracker, but uh, this thing I do like a lot, but if you didn't like it, you can turn them on and off, so best of both worlds. It's not even an option, not even an afterbirth that they add a stat tracker. They really want to obscure things, and I never felt like that was a good way for this game to go. I don't understand that. Uh, not telling the player how things work, having the wiki shit. I, I don't get it. I guess some people like that, I don't know why. They like trying to figure things out themselves, I suppose. Which is fun to an extent, but some items... After, like... I probably have 1500 hours between the two games now. Uh, I still barely know how some of the items work. Having wikied them, I still don't understand how they work. I forget what trinkets do all the time, like... Um, I know what this poop item I have does, but I don't know uh, off the top of my head what like the red ribbon thing does or things like that. I forget all the time. Thanks, Isaac, for shooting me in the head, you jerk. This might be tough uh, to do with only one hit. Why did I t pick up the dead cat? I'm so bad. <laughs> Oh, 
I just can't resist the chance to get Guppy. I'm dead and I'll have to restart this whole fight because he's a tanky boy. I really like this boss though. Oh, I resisted that. I didn't even see him shoot me. Oh man, I'm glad that that thing procced. How lucky. That's interesting. D100. I really want rubber cement, though. So we're going to, um... Uh, how, how can I... I'm trying to think of how I can keep rubber cement and roll the book, and I don't think I can. I'll have to either give up an item or lose rubber cement, which is the optimal strategy. Okay, whatever. We're just gonna roll the book. And if I don't like my build, I can re-roll again. I've got Brimstone. <laughs> Do I like my build? Hmm, let's try it out in a room here. It's not great. I think I have Strange Attractor or something. Yeah, fuck that. That's pretty weird. God. Ah! Get, get out of my face with those, man. Nice. All is planned. Exactly what I was looking for there, yeah. You know it. Uh, Strange Attractor maybe on Brimstone isn't so bad. I'm gonna try it out in one more room here. Hold on. It's locking them into the Brimstone. I think it's their strange attractor, the good one. If there can be called a good strange attractor, it's the one that they created. That being said, this isn't that great. We can probably get something better. I do have that menorah though, so... I think rolling this would be an error in judgment. I don't think I need to do the stand fight. Son of a bitch. I should have gone and healed. You jerks. My damage isn't very great. Yeah, they got me. Am I stacking brims? It doesn't look like it. It should be quad shot right now, but it's it's totally not. Okay, I'm gonna have to re-roll. Let me go up here and see. This double cage fight is not gonna happen. <laughs> re-roll here. What do we get? We got more damage. Oh, well, I've never seen this item before. Didn't I pick you up already? Damage up. That was an insanely good experimental treatment. See that? Okay, one second.
Never seen this melee weapon before. This is nice. I never understood why they didn't just make a melee weapon like this. Let's see what it does in damage terms. A lot, damn. Why oh, you son of a bitch, Cage? Die! I'm afraid of that bomb fly there. Yeah, my <laughs> fucking bomb fly. I gotta go heal. We keeping this? We can roll a bunch of cards if we're keeping this. I've got 30 soul hearts. I can make a ton of cards. Or do we want to roll again? Oh, nice. I got a little blaster, but I'm full health. Fuck. You bastard. Taking a lot of hits, um, trying to fight. Hey, I don't get hit by his jaggies. He's my buddy. I don't know if I'm gonna make it with this. I'm gonna reroll. I just don't do enough with it right now. Let's see what else we can grab. I love rerolling anyway. I don't know what that candle does, but I, <laughs> I got my my bouncy tears. Even though I rerolled them earlier, that's pretty strange. I'm gonna try this. This is winnable. I'm gonna go win real quick, just to make sure that we have this. I got my reflection right now. I don't know if that's a randomized thing or not. I think it might be random. It's okay. We still got him. Regular bombs. I'm always surprised to see regular bombs when I roll that many items. Not a single bomb upgrade. It's on currently. Not even one. What the hell is that thing? I'm, oh, that's <laughs> that was the leech upside down. It was freaking me out. Ow. I, did, I just noticed I have eight hearts. Whatever, you're dead. What else we can get? This sucks. What else you got? This works. <laughs> I like that. I don't like that. What's that? Where did that come from? Why am I shooting bombs all of a sudden? Are these the... I wonder if they fixed the Dr. Fetus bombs, if they're still... Br they look like they're scaling pretty well. They used to suck. They were awful. They were bugged for the entirety of Afterbirth. Down I go. <laughs> Oops. That's too dangerous to use. What's this? This is Cursed Eye. No thanks. I don't really know what this is, but... I think they fixed the um, the way D D D roll is because I'm not collecting red hearts. They're making me um, all that rules, but um, I think they did fix this. It's it's working the way it should have always worked, and it's not just stacking stuff and making me immortal. I think that's the problem here because I've lost red hearts in that deal. This is outrageous, though. So whatever, coming through, suckers. <laughs> How you doing, little poops? Little poop boys. We can fight and make a stand in a minute here. Let's see if we can beat him with this ridiculous mess that I've got. Not that I need to. I still get credit for the win if I kill make a stand, don't I? I'm pretty sure I do.
I need I need credit for the unlock. That's what I want. And I haven't stepped on the uh, the win button for the chest, so hopefully Stan will give that to me when I kill him. Pretty sure he will. I gotta go kill Mega Stan. He's unlocked, ready to go. I just haven't uh, felt like doing him yet. I'm gonna drop him with this build. You guys think this damage is good? You should have seen my uh, <laughs> should have seen my tears that were the size of the screen times ten. I had ten of them that were so big that this spot on the tears, the little glowy spot, uh, was the entire screen, and it never expired. It was permanently on screen. It was a static tear that would, it was like Ludovico tears basically times ten. It was the best. Okay, let's jump in here. <laughs> Oops! Good battle, buddy. Here, have a death card. I don't need that. Let's re-roll. <laughs> Hit him with the minions. The mess. I can't see. Oh no. Eat the gek. Let's re-roll again. Let's re-roll again. <laughs> you know what happened there? We got Abaddon in the reroll and it killed us, I think. Let's reroll again. We have to go fight him again, all over. From scratch. Oh, those are nice. What are those? The Book of Despair. Temporary tears up. The Book of Despair. Temporary tears up. Tears up. Tears up. Tears up. Tears up, tears up. I don't know if it actually works multiple times. It doesn't scale. It doesn't stack, I guess. Hey! Let's reroll. Let's. I don't like that reroll. Let's try again. Yuck. This is Ipecac. Ipecac triangles. Pretty good. I like that. Too bad they're homing in on me because of uh, my reflection. Or something. Something horrible. I can't- I can't keep that. Gotta reroll. We get the sword. Let's stab him. Damn troll bomb. I'm really sad that this doesn't destroy projectiles like a nuclear throne. I'm gonna have to reroll it because of that, because it's gonna be insanely hard to win this guy with this. Unless it does a ton of damage, and I don't think it does. Let's reroll. I like this. Pretty good. Too bad the strange attractor's on. Magic mushroom help. <laughs> <laughs> 
Ugh, we got chocolate milk, magnetic tears, quad shot thing. Roll. That was a really, really bad experimental treatment. Damn, that sucked. That was atrocious. That was like what it usually is. It took like four points off my damage. Oh no, he's dead. I'm looking at this chat. No, look at the loot. No. Oh, I didn't get to see it. Son of a bitch. That's too bad. Well, we got him. <laughs> I did get my thing, so that's one down. I didn't get the boss rush because I'm a horrible player and I lost the monstro. So now we need to do a dark room run with her and do the boss rush. Actually succeed. I think they did change experimental treatment. I think that was a. I think I saw a negative three on damage when I re-rolled it there. I don't know. Maybe it was multiplied though. It might have been because I had a multiplier on that it did so much. Taking one damage away when you have mo magic mushroom on would take more than one. Probably. Damn. I've got three hearts, so I've got two reds left. That's my status right now. They're hiding. Two and a half. I need a bomb. It's gonna be hard to bomb that without missing, too. I really want flight for that room. Damn that fly, he's killing my fire. Little dumpers. Nice, I love this item. I wonder if it's... Oh no, it doesn't work on those, that's too bad. Shame. I'm gonna explore the whole floor, look for a bomb, maybe. If I'm lucky, find one. Shit, that big fat guy, champion boy, is not dying. Ah, we're done here. No bombs. Man, I need two, too. Well, they're not as good as they usually are since they give me soul hearts, but uh, it's nice to have a few power ups. My fire! No! Well, we can go get these, or at least attempt to. Question is, do I want to try and get those ones there? Can I get to those? I guess I can't, actually. There's no way to successfully do that, uh, that I see, because I would need another... 
I guess I could go up here this way and get to them, but I don't really want to do that. I'd rather get the marked rocks, so. We can get this easy one. And then try. Oh, there's another bomb. You know what? Maybe I do want to do that. Fuck that marked rock. Oh, no, I can't. Shit. Well, we're we'll just. Hopefully, we'll get this now. Am I going to be able to get it? I don't know. Drop it there. Maybe this will work. Nope, not quite. We got this. I thought I could get to those chests, but I couldn't make it. And then I screwed up getting to the marked rock, too. This is pretty good. I'll take that. That's better than most of what I would have found. Uh, did I miss a Patreon question? Let me see. Um... My... P <laughs> thanks to some very generous folks, uh, my Patreon is bursting at the seams at like 2600 right now. But, um, subs are good too. Subs technically give me less money, but I am trying to get to 500 subs eventually because, um... I want more emotes and, uh, also maybe can work out some Twitch bargains then. Shit, don't hit me, no! Get out of here! Jeez! I'm using- fuck that, man, I'm not having a situation like that again. Anyway, whatever you want to do, if you want emotes, just go ahead and sub. But, uh, Patreon does technically give me more money. I'm pretty well off right now, though. I'm- I'm not in any dire straits at all, uh, so, you know, if you want to support my stream, Patreon is technically the best way. But uh, watching an ad dropping the bits money in here will quickly add up to the same amount of money. I'm gonna use all these. I'm just turning them all on. Fuck it. We're going to war. Let's get them. Twitch. <laughs> yeah, I still can't get ad bits. I don't know why. It makes me sad. <clears throat> I do have, um, I've been trying to get, uh, I, I'm at 265 subs right now, so I'm nowhere near 500. I'm hoping next year I can hit that number. That's my goal. That's my stream goal for next year. I have gone well and above beyond all my current stream goals for this year. The only one I didn't hit that I don't really understand why I can't seem to get is the follower 10k thing. I wanted to hit that. I think I had like 4,000 followers at the start of the year, so despite having consistently streamed with 300 to 700 viewers, <laughs> I just can't get followers. I don't know why. I just don't get that number to go up. It doesn't really matter that much, I guess. But, uh, it's just one of the goals I had that not even close. But I have way more subs than I wanted. Uh. Let's see how it goes next year. Hey, thanks for the sub, actually. <laughs> Enjoy my awful emotes. Oi, oh. Yeah, this kicks ass. This is just a barrage. I've got five minutes down. I, this will help me get the, to the boss rush in time. I definitely want to do that. That's definitely the goal here, so. Keeping my fire alive will help me burn through here. I need to not explore the whole floor just for the sake of doing it. That's a waste of time. I should not have come in here. Big waste of time. Yeah. Luck is a bad stat, that's why you always have zero luck. <laughs> I guess the secret to getting followers is to just say, Yo, where's the follows at? <laughs> I just got three. Thanks for following. Yeah, I, I sometimes feel like, um... I don't get taken very seriously because my followers number is so low. 
even though my viewership is ridiculously high for this number of followers. Ow. Son of a bitch. I'm glad he doesn't destroy my fire, but I really shouldn't have been hit by that. No, I lost my devil deal. No, I didn't. Nice. Oh, this thing is, um... You know what? We can get... Hmm. Maybe I want to use that a couple times. Turn those soul hearts into red hearts. Can I get... I can't use it. I don't have enough. Too bad. Because I didn't pick that up. Damn, I'm bad. If I had just clicked that button, I would have been... Hmm. What? <laughs> Thanks for the follower, Barrage. I'm pretty close to 7,000. If you guys are new here, you should check me out on Sunday, because, uh... That's my big show, and you ain't nothing. You ain't seen nothing like it. I guarantee it. I ain't doing it on Christmas Day. Yeah, that's right. I'm not doing one on Christmas Day, so maybe on the first. I think is my first. I'm inviting some speedrunners to run on it uh, on the first. I make them do all kinds of stuff, and I make fun of them while they do it. It's great. I do a bunch of other shows too, but that's my big one. I do it every Sunday. The only Sundays I'm going to miss are Christmas, and um, I'm going to MAGFest, so I'm going to miss that one too. Other than that, I'm going to do every single one. Hey, thanks for the- that's a lot of bits, Ellen Zombie. You see, we didn't get the charity message when you did it, and I wonder why. Those worked, right? Is it because you capitalized charity? <laughs> Yeah, uh, if you use black soul hearts to make flames, they become explosive when they when they die, which is great. Uh, they keep the effect of the black soul hearts, and they even got rid of the animation on the soul hearts, so they just play. You know that stupid uh, one second animation that every time one pops, it takes forever. I mean, it doesn't take forever, but it adds up. This is a really well thought out character, honestly. It's a bit on the powerful side, though. A bit too strong, maybe? <laughs> uh, easy to get some ridiculous run going with this, but that's okay. What's wrong with having overpowered characters? Here, I'm dead. No, we're, we're fine, because my flames don't actually use this. So I can control my shots just fine. I don't want the world card. High Priest is good damage. I don't really need it anymore, though, because this is gold. Well, thanks for the follows and bits, folks. Like I said, uh, show, type exclamation and show, and you'll, uh, there's a ton of videos of it on YouTube, you can see all of them, but it's definitely my big thing, if you ain't seen it before, you should stop by. I guarantee we've had people on there that you know, too. I think the biggest person we had on there was Cryotic, but we have, um... Proton John's on all the time. And I invited a bunch of Twitch partners last year, this year. <coughs> we have speedrunners on there sometimes, but they really don't do very well. As well as you would think, anyway. Aha! I just ruined my devil deal thanks to that mushroom. So ah! It's awful. Rubber cement uh, on Ipecac, maybe not the greatest thing. This book doesn't have a lot of synergy with Ipecac either. I don't really like it right now. That's not good. Oh, that's bad. We've got 10 minutes to do three floors.
Yeah, there is a new super secret boss. He kicks ass. I'm gonna do some runs of him because I have to for this character and all the other characters. I did it on Isaac, so that's the only one that's done right now. Ugh, take this. Thankfully, my fire can hold this uh, room for me. Because my Ipecac shots are all screwed up right now. Yeah, the Devil Deal thing is pretty rude, I don't know. It's a... Bad holdover. Thanks for the sub. Bogle? Uh, yeah. I don't know what to say about the Devil Deal thing, other than that... It rewards good playing. And that's not really... The greatest idea, since... The people who are playing well don't... Really need the help, and also... It's pretty much mandatory to win that because the devil deals are so strong that they make or break your run. They're not just items, they're they're the best items. I feel like the angel room items in this mod are pretty good. That's weird to say, but they're actually pretty good. Here we thanks for the bits. They are really good in this mod, but you need to do the same thing to get those too, so it's the same situation. You have to do a perfect run to get um I don't think this character can even get devil deals, so. I'm glad the angel rooms are good now. <laughs> I'm having a really hard time because of rubber cement. I really shouldn't have uh, picked that up, and I, I hate to say that because I like that item a lot. But it does not scale with Epicac correctly. I didn't get my item on this floor. Do I care? I guess I do. Let's go find it. Man, come on. Let me stop it. Speed and range, okay. If you're the kind of player who gets hit a lot in this game, you probably won't see very many double deals except for Joker cards. It's just the way it's going to be. You'll get one or two, maybe. Because they do add up over time. Like, it's at 75% now. Not 100, but, uh... Man, that's a lot of rock money. It's because of this Lucky Stone thing. Bolt. Got him. I gotta get to the, um... I got six minutes to clear two floors. I can do that. It's just... A little bit of a rush, but not too much. I can poison these guys, so I can blast through them even though they're shielded. Technically, it takes forever though. I'm having a hard time hitting them. Maybe I'll just go. Jerk! There goes my devil deal. Just took a hit from that jerk. I missed that notice, but uh, thank you. Or whatever that was. Uh, 
I haven't seen this lady get a single double deal. I didn't think she could. Maybe it's because of the book, ruining things. I don't know that ruining things is accurate, honestly, anymore. Not in this mod. I got four and a half minutes so I can get this item and get down and clear depths too easy. Okay. That doesn't really help much. Such a tanky boy monster too. I don't know which of these I want. What does that cross do? Does anyone know? I don't know what any of these do. <laughs> Either of those two. I'll wait till someone tells me. I don't think it's a big deal. Which one's the most interesting for Ipecac? I don't think that that's uh, Sacred Heart, is it? Yeah, I think you're right. I think the cross is the... Uh, what's this? This is Halo 2. Oh, no! Hmm. I've had this before, actually, I think. Ah! Oh, no! What have I done? Oh, jeez. This is the thing I used to break the game before, but I didn't have Ipecac shots last time. Ah! It's not the same thing. This is the tiny planet things that Maddie was talking about. Oh, they're slowly descending on me. This is gross. This is really bad. This is the worst. I'm gonna get massacred by this. God. I'm dead as hell. There's no way I can win now. All hope is lost. This run is ruined. I need, I need bomb immunity to still win. There's no other way to do this. I'm never gonna be able to do the boss rush like this. Poison. Die faster, please. <laughs> I can outrun them. I wish they would not follow me like that. Gah. Let's bust in here. The old stopwatch. Pretty solid. <laughs> we got a minute left here. Well, you're dead, at least. Anything in here that will save me? I don't know what that bottom right one is. I'll pick it up and find out, I guess. Oh, it's this. This will help. This will get them on the Ipecac shots that I fire a little bit. That boss is dead instantly, so no red poops in this arena. This is just the one, I guess. I need to keep moving to dodge my own shots. We can probably do the boss rush anyway. 
handicap. That stopwatch is huge. Huge help. Fortunately, this room's big enough that I can dodge most of my crappy reflection. Ow. Why is Monster 2 ruining me in here again? Well, we're gonna make it, it looks like. No problem. Got enough damage to survive, even though I hit myself uh, once or twice. Oh, they definitely hurt me. No question about that. Those orbiting tears definitely do damage to me. It's just unlikely I'll get hit by them unless I run into them. Ugh. Where's this enemy at? Hey. Wrapping this up now. That's faith. That might be a better item than the fires. Uh, I think it might actually be. I'm gonna take it. The fire does not work with my uh, Ipecac shots at all. It's nice to have, man, it does not help me out any. I'd, I'd be just as well without it, so. Now we have this, and we can something like 10 times shoot to whoop at the enemies, and they do ridiculous Ipecac damage, so that's instant death. That's actually better. Somehow, for this. Take this. <laughs> There's my penny. Thanks.
Okay, that's pretty solid. Ow. I'm taken out. There's a full heal. Yeah, this is anti birth. That's the new mod. It's brand new. It's really good. Would recommend. Yeah, look at that damage. In case you doubted me on my uh, opinions of this laser, it really is pretty good in this situation. Instantly killing the bloat. He's pretty tanky. Would have killed him three times over. I think I'm gonna play with this guy. I might do this guy too. Maybe I shouldn't, because I'm a little unsafe about my hearts. Normally I'd be expecting a guaranteed win with nine hearts and this much damage, but I don't know. Maybe if hearts drop on the floor and I have stuff to spare, I'll play with the devil guy. I really can't, um, I should be able to blast that platform this way, but I can't do- there we go. <laughs> like, there's a marked rock here. It's because it's bouncing, because of rubber cement, I couldn't do it. Ow. We don't need those. Later. change. There's no way for me to hurt him without getting hit. That's not good. Sh shot speed might actually matter with this item. When I picked up the stopwatch, I pretty much sealed my victory. That's my expectation, even with these horrible tears that are backfiring on me. I'm just taking my time and making sure I get my win. Better. Oh, she dodged instantly. Wow, what a jerk. Why'd she do that? That's weird. That's my double deal. That item there, <laughs> pretty scary. Drains all of my hearts for damage. Definitely don't want that. Uh, the challenge that this lady has. Oh shit, did I grab the wrong thing? I did, didn't I? I didn't even think about it. Did anyone mention that? Because I totally fucked it up. Uh, I didn't grab the Polaroid, uh, the dark Polaroid thing. I can't go do the thing I wanted to do on this run. I can only fight Stan. It's, it's garbage, I ruined it. I just automatically picked the Polaroid every time. I didn't even think about it. Even, it took me this long to realize, too. 
Only when I'm going down to shield do I realize I don't have the right thing for the job. We're gonna have to go another run of Bethany. Because of that. I can't go to the dark chest. Not unless they changed it. I doubt they did. Whoops. Pick that. Yeah, I know I didn't pick it. I didn't even think about that I made that mistake. I should have realized it immediately. I was busy with wanting to do the boss rush. At least I got that done. Not that it's a big deal. Boss rush is pretty easy. They might have changed it in this mod. Let's pretend we're doing it on purpose to find out if this mod changed the rules behind needing the Polaroid or not. It's kind of a dumb rule. It was really dumb when it was a trinket slot. I'm glad they changed that at least. But in the process of doing so, you, you would think that he would have also realized you don't really need to make me pick this up every time, huh? They never did realize that. for those to go away. Okay. Goodbye. You're dead as heck. Okay, we're finished with this at least. We have to do another run though, yeah. Bad. Are we gonna do that run again? Unfortunately. I am going in there. That's a really good item. Uh, I'm not gonna use it over this though, this item's better. Ah, I got a guppy piece at least. I doubt they do, but what if the, uh, what if the fires park guppy flies? Oops. I gotta protect my fire better. I'm not gonna use my soul hearts until I feel like I have a, a wall of them built, because until then they're pretty vulnerable. 
it'd be pretty tough to get this thing killed too without wasting it. That really blows. That's like the worst item in the game. I wonder which one of these is the library. I don't really care. Well, I do now. Yeah, this boss would decimate my fires. I gotta fight him without that. It's gonna be pretty tough, too. Be a rude boss. Really bad item, man. I'm gonna go pick up that heart there. Ooh, three minutes on floor one ain't great, but I don't need to worry about the boss rush too much anymore, so. I could head to those special zones. Let's use all these. We need this to snowball if we can't get it to start rolling, it's gonna be tough goings. She'll never see her advantage if she can't get these off the ground, so. I need to protect them for a while until I have like eight going, and then I'm probably good. That's good. I'll go in that curse room, but only after the boss is dead. Imagine how long this would have taken if I didn't have these fires, these freaking spawner rooms with that pathetic damage. Ugh. God. Ah, they ruined my deal, a son of a bitch. Somehow got one through. That really sucks. We still have a very small chance. Like 65%, I guess isn't too small, but. Before we take any more hits, let's get this guy dead. Flame destroying boss, man. Nope. Too bad. I didn't get an item or a store on the last floor just because I didn't feel like pissing around with it, but I really should have. Or should have tried. Thanks, kiddo. You too. Man! I hate this room. I really hate this room. <laughs> There's just nothing to be done about that, man. My fire caused that to happen. There's no dodging with a hitbox that big. It's bad enough with a normal hitbox. getting screwed out of my deals. 
That's not good. This one's not gone too hot. I think it is really strong early, but I don't think she's that great later. If I don't get any upgrades, I'm gonna be in trouble. Because these tiers that I'm shooting do not scale. Let's go in here. Hmm. I'm gonna sneak through here, I'm just gonna run for it. You see, they just don't take damage from this fast enough to kill them. This guy sucks. Ugh. Very unimpressive little buddy. I hate to shit on a little dumper, but uh, he's a new one and he's not so great. He reminds me of the peeper, the way he floats around and doesn't really do much. I think if they run into him, he farts on him. <laughs> that is totally an afterbirth kind of follower right there. One that doesn't do much at all. Okay. I'm just not getting these deals, man. That's too bad. Callan Zombie, damn, thanks again. <laughs> 1500, damn. It's another $3 to charity, by the way. Okay, let's roll this. I'm gonna I'm, uh, do my marathon stream on Monday. I think. 26th. I was planning on doing it later in the month, but um, Wednesday we'll miss that whole charity thing, so I'm gonna get going on it sooner. I really want this to be a dice room, but it's not. It's one of the... Yeah, that's the worst thing it could have been. That really sucks. It's a bunch of garbage in there, man. Yuck. Yuck. God. My, my fires. No. I might go back and open up those now that- ooh. I'll take it. We'll try it. I wonder if it comes with the same penalty. I don't think it does. Uh, that's pretty okay damage. I think they lessened the penalty to 35% like it used to be. Uh, they fixed up an afterbirth. I think they kept uh, some of that change because it still feels pretty good. It didn't seem like it dropped too much. Give me homing. I get the same amount of bits from donation events as I normally do. You just gave me $15 and also $3 to charity. That's what you just did. Bits have never not been one-to-one -one for the streamer. As far as I know. It's for as long as I've seen them. And I had them on day one. Like, I was in the beta for bits. Cheering. They've always been one-to-one -one for the streamer. From day one. They continue to be even during events. God damn it! That little f backwards fly they added shot me and it ruined my deal. 
That sucks. I just want one, man. Just one of those items. Come on. I'm in a lot of trouble without them. Oh, I'm trapped. Oh, I'm doomed. Shit. It just keeps on dropping down. Now I have no fires, and I've got tech. This really sucks. I should probably just restart. <laughs> this is the worst. This couldn't be much worse than it is. She's kind of overpowered though, so this is actually a pretty regular run at this point. Without my fires going and with tech 2, is pretty standard crap. Pretty boring, crappy run that I've got going on. I didn't like that tiny fire either. But it burned it up. Finally! The mind. I might as well hit these up. Nothing for it. I'm debating going down there. I think I will. To the secret zone? Yeah. Let's just do it. Maybe we'll get some good stuff in there, huh? It's pretty tough, but uh... Yeah, range town doesn't do anything to me. I need to make sure that I'm in depths too, so I need to bail out of this secret areas before I do. Um, I can do two floors of this secret area before I have to bail, basically. Two floors, so I need to get out of here before the, f the second boss of the um, mausoleum place. Because I don't want to be here for that or I'll miss my my dark Polaroid thing. Nice. A choice. Dry Baby's better. Um. I feel like you get more stuff in these super secret zones. I should probably come down here anyway. There's a library over there. Uh, Discord updates every like 10 minutes. Something like that. I want that key. It'll happen on its own. I don't do that. It's automatic. The eraser is not bad, but I don't think it works on bosses. It's basically the chaos card for regular enemies, and it kills every enemy type in the room. Like, if there's five Gerties, it'll kill all of them in one throw. That's a soul heart in disguise. The mimic heart there. Jerk. Nice! Not so nice. <laughs> That's much less interesting than it could have been. But well, whatever. Let's go down and get the, uh, the boss rush. Well, not, I mean the, uh, the boss. Do I want in the library? Nah. I can't imagine taking anything out of there. Thunderous fat boy. Um, why aren't you on there? What? Let me, I can do it manually, let me try. Let's see. Only 121 people subbed through Discord, that's weird. It says it just did it.
You have to do it. You have to integrate Discord and Twitch. You have to log in your Twitch account through Discord. If you haven't done that, that won't work. I have 260, 270 subs, and only 121 of them have bothered to do that. That's interesting. Let's go. Damn it. Man. I can't believe they're getting through these shields. It's amazing. Why the hell would it give you a virus? What do you mean? No. <laughs> Answer that is no. Absolutely not. Did something happen to it? It's not when I was using it. Oh, I don't like this boss. He's immune unless I bomb him. But at least they give me bombs. That would be really bad if they didn't. I wonder if the bombs um, do regular bomb damage, because in that case, it might be better to just throw these at him a bunch. I think they might. He's dead. Seems like they are regular bombs. Pretty good. Ah. It's hard to hit him because he's randomly moving. Oh, I shouldn't have used all those if I wanted to go down the. Um let me look for one more soul heart. Um, I mean, if you have a battery, it's really good. You could just keep this shit going. That's what would happen. You can max it out at 16. Pretty easily, if it's a single charge, you'll do it. You don't really need anything more than that. A single charge, it's more than enough. Ah, uh, that room in there does not look like it's worth two keys. Just putting that out there. This room down here is a bed. I don't really need that either. I don't have a lot of bombs to spare. Son of a bitch! Give me the poison death blast. I don't see any soul hearts anywhere. Oh well, we're just gonna have to go to the regular depths. That's too bad because the mausoleum actually does pay off. Maybe the store has one for sale. I'll check. I got money. We blasted in here. No, I, I must have used them all. There could be one in the library. Uh, I need two, unfortunately. Okay, so that will work, I think. Because it doubles up your soul hearts. She does, anyway. She cheats a little bit and doubles up soul hearts for battery use, so... Maybe we can get in here now? I wasn't sure if these worked or not. Oh, no, she can't do that, actually. They make sure you can't. She used two on that door. Too bad. Damn knights, ugh, they're gonna be the worst! Killing my fire like that. Nowhere to run. 
hitbox so big on it. I think Afterbirth ruined the game. I agree. I think Afterbirth is trash. Someone who's probably played it more than most people. I would say it ruined the game in an incomprehensibly bad way. I don't know what they were thinking with that mess. I agree. This is much better. Yeah, Afterbirth sucks. Made me quit. And I like this game a lot. For me to quit, oh man, they must have fucked up. Like that alone should say a lot. If I quit, then uh, I, I I really don't like any of the design decisions in Afterbirth. It's just disgustingly bad all around. I have nothing but bad things to say about that whole DLC. This is a really good item for you, Mr. Red, uh, Mrs. Redhearts. Okay, so, I guess we could just go to the boss. They put Ragman on floor one. He's not a bad boss. I don't mind Ragman, but he ain't no floor one boss. Uh, you run into him way too much. They got rid of all the floor one bosses that were good. Like Dingle, you never see him in the Afterbirth anymore. He just doesn't show up down there at all. He's only in the womb as a sub-boss. Then there's uh, Greed and Hush, disgustingly bad ideas. Like, the worst ideas that have ever happened. <laughs> well, the purity, hmm. The Keeper's really bad. Damn, is he bad. You know what? I'm lucky I didn't go to the other floor. Apparently I uh, skipped a floor. That's not good, actually. Wouldn't want to do that normally, but, um... I thought the mausoleum was depths, but apparently I'm wrong. I was going to end up missing my Polaroid and not being able to do the run I want to do. You jerk. I'm gonna use this. I should have saved it for mapping, but whatever. We ain't in a hurry. Is she unique? What's she's a special cyan mom? I don't know what she's doing differently. Other than kicking my ass, my tech two let me down here. We did hush runs more than probably anybody in the world. Uh, just every night we would just run them and talk about how bad that boss is for like a month. Hush runs over and over again. And I can't believe she's beating me. This just is not working. Okay, well, we want this. I don't know if we're gonna make it now. That hurt. We do get double heals. Afterbirth added a couple good items, by which I mean overpowered trash, like Tech X, way too good. Just, just a situation where you don't even think about how good your item is, they throw that in there. Lilith is okay, not very interesting. Keeper is the worst. And it's all because of minor tweaks would fix it, he just rolled with them. Without those tweaks, he just... I don't know, I don't know how you can implement a character with triple shot and make it bad, but he found a way. There's enough hard characters, you don't need to keep adding lost challenges and grinds. Having to put a thousand coins in that greed machine is probably the worst idea of them all. Even worse than the health scaling super boss. <laughs> Not only does that, that boss scale for health, but he also has blocking damage. Like, um, if you do too much damage, he'll scale that way too. And also, he goes immortal all the time, as if it's not bad enough. And he shoots a bunch of immortal flies that take 10 seconds to become vulnerable. Why did that happen? What made that? What made that? Dry baby must have done that, I guess. The wrong upgrades make him harder. The right upgrades get around the thing. 
Incubus and Succubus are good, but you know what? Their addition makes Angel Rooms even worse. So there's there's a problem there too. Ah, I'm gonna die. I got hit by that. I was focused on the other boy. I'm in a lot of trouble if I do not find some red hearts soon. One of the biggest problems this game has is making devil rooms required to win. Ah, they got through my flames. Down I go. I gotta restart. That was not a very good run. Anyway, yeah. Angel rooms in this game suck. Um, this mod fixed it up, made angel rooms pretty good. Afterbirth made them even worse by adding even more bad items to it. And only adding good devil deal items. Like a bunch of good ones. I'll take this. And maybe make use of this. Ugh. Leave me alone. Yeah, they also added things like you can't get an item without taking damage because they put spikes in front of it. They added angel room chests that are locked and they put them in the angel rooms. So even if you do have the potential to get a good item in the angel room, even if you did, now you have the chance to get in there and have to use a key. Like, what? Why are those a the thing? They, it's like he did everything he could to make sure that Devil Deals were the only option. So you, you're always locked down one path. Just one of the many millions of problems that this game has amplified. It's really strange. I don't know why they made these choices. Leo's kind of dangerous, but I like smashing rocks, so I'll take the penalty that he offers for that. You gotta be careful in the wrong rooms, though. You can take some damage stepping on the wrong rock rocks here. Stepping on these urns is very likely to spawn spiders. There they are. I quit after birth because of the grind, though. Being real, that was my biggest problem of all, was the grind. Couldn't believe that I had to put a thousand coins in two at a time after doing an hour run, like, it takes like 20 minutes, no matter what, and no matter how you play it, you can't do anything about it. They did seem to patch that eventually, though. Even they realized that uh, that was a big error. Made it easier to do. Alright, let's go. I don't like you as a boss, you're gonna mess me up. Eh, maybe not. Not not I can get rid of the jars, you ain't really got much. He's gonna hit me with his spread shot though. If he does it. Take my fires away. <laughs> I'm pushing him away. You stay over there, buddy. Haunt on floor one is pretty rude, but he's not he's not as bad as Ragman. I really don't feel like he is. Ragman is sometimes unplayably hard, like he just summons enemies and that you can't kill, and they shoot homing shots, and he's just not a good boss. And neither is the poop boss, the ultra poop that's on depths. He's out of control too. Come here, you. Running away. Ragman being the hardest is amplified by how common he is, too. He's more common than anything. I hate seeing him, but he's always there. It's always Ragman. It's ridiculous. Sometimes it's champion Ragman. Sometimes you just cannot win that fight. We do a lot of Eden runs, so we get random garbage all the time. Sometimes we have really bad runs, like we don't even have basic stats, and it's just not good for us.
I've just about maxed out my um, fire wheel here. So now we can start sitting on soul hearts. The advantage of Leo, I think, is going to have some synergy here because we can get every marked rock without worrying about it. I'm also looking for um, black markets would be nice and not really a big deal. Probably prudent to go in the store here. Is there a cave? I don't know which one this is. This might be the. I think it is probably the store. Let's check. Damn. I am going in there. Whatever. I think it is the store. Okay. Obvious choice here is that broken ass thing. Uh, it wouldn't be a bad idea to go to the special floors, I just need to make sure I get off at uh, the end of the mines. One to lowest stat. Range is the lowest stat? It's 21! Oh, well, whatever. I don't really like either of those. I'll take this. Do we want to waste the key going to the mines is the question. I guess we do, sure. It's not the mines, it's the, um... This hell. <laughs> this is what it is. Okay, so downpour too. I need to make sure that I get out on depths too, and I'm not really clear on how that works. It seems like after mines one, I should take the regular exit. I want that to happen. I want to do the dark chest, dark room with this lady before I do this, but um, if we get a particularly good run, I might just go for it, because I need to do this with her too. So I'm not going to ignore the knife pieces. Really good damage item there. Alright. I should probably go grab that bomb in that other room. I'm out of keys. I need to save my, um, soul hearts, man. But I'm gonna keep on charging my fires up. Just keep piece one. Knife piece. Oh, you fight... You do fight Mom anyway, don't you? I think it can get the Polaroid regardless. I guess you can. It forces you into that room. That's right. What am I thinking? You just have to fight an obscenely hard version of Mom that never existed before. <laughs> That's all. But you do still get the, um... We're still good. I don't need to worry about it. I can just do whatever I want. I can go any path I want. I'm gonna fight this boss before I get hit. Because I don't want to end up, um, losing my Devil Deal. Come on out. Hey. gonna be a pretty tricky boss unless he gets stuck so stop watch nice he's dead I was gonna say he would be pretty tricky to do without taking damage and he still is a little bit I have to proc this a couple times without getting hit to get him to do this next thing yeah he should be coming out the wall now right now Come on. Now he's doing it. Ha! <laughs> he was ruined by it. Yeah, stop watching ruin this boss. I don't know why I didn't get a deal. Oh well. I'm gonna hold on to that moon card in case I did do get the boss rush. I'm allowed to go to the mausoleum, I just have to have four soul hearts in my little bank. I am allowed to do that. 
account. They just take two because she adds two in there anyway. I'll get that in a second. I'll probably find a coin. Yeah. Hey, thanks for the follow. Wink, PhD. <laughs> Better pills, Peabody. Mmm. Oh yeah, that's another thing that Afterbirth really fucked up is pills. What were they thinking? Why are there so many bad pills? They're supposed to be a risk, not completely useless. I would advise not using pills at all in Afterbirth, if that's what you're playing. They suck. They're, uh, they're just garbage. So many of them are pointless. That's a major component of the game that they ruined. Pills. They, yeah, one of the challenges that you have to do to unlock them, you get perks and addicted, which are opposites. One of them is good, technically, one of them is bad, technically. They pretty much do nothing. So there's just two pills in the, uh, the run that do nothing in addition to the three that already exist. And then there is uh, Relaxed, which also may as well do nothing. There's two versions of Infested. Those are so minor, they may as well do nothing. They do different things. Very incredibly bad pills. The worst thing about them ruining that is that they increase the size too, so you can, uh, if you had tears up, if you somehow got the one good pill, um, you'd have to sort through 13 or something ridiculous number of pills to actually find another one. Missing an enemy, there he is. Still alive. Pretty tough. I wouldn't expect Afterbirth to do anything but make it worse. <laughs> I, I would say they probably will just amplify all the bad things they've done and then rely on the mods to make their game fun. That's probably what's gonna happen. Add to some good revs. Mimics. Soul Heart Mimics. I need to save those for the, um... Probably should have gone for the other thing. Especially looking on it now, as I only use that one time. Whoops. I'm just so used to thinking it's a good item. It has no synergy with her. Just a waste. That's okay. That other item wouldn't help much anyway. Yeah, the Afterbirth did add a lot of synergies, gotta give them credit for that, because that's actually a good thing that they did. They fixed, finally, they fixed some bugs that they shouldn't have needed DLC to fix. Can't really give them credit for that, they took forever. 
no post-game uh, updates at all for this. This don't exist. This guy is in slow motion. He's still moving that fast. Damn. Jeez, he doesn't care about stopwatch at all. This is minions do. This gross boy is moving way too fast, man. To get out of his way. He's immune to his own bombs. What a jerk. Oh, jeez. They almost got him. God, there's too much going on in this battle. Oh, man. Come on. He's dead. I took so many hits. I don't know how to fight this thing at all. It's gross. really fucked up my flames and I gotta rebuild it from scratch. Peep, what do you mean? Anyone else hear anything weird? I don't, I don't know about no high pitched peep. Thanks for follow. You mean that? Is my sound screwing up? I don't hear nothing in the music. Ah, fuck, man. I'm not used to that. I'm not used to Mark Rocks being dangerous. Man. Devil Deal gone because of a Mark Rock that had mimics in it. Never am I gonna get used to that. I just stepped on another one without even thinking about it. Because, uh. So you used to Mark Rocks being safe. Hey, thanks for the uh, help there, Cave Guys. I don't really want that though. The second key piece. I feel like the next floor is where things really start to help on this. Ah, great. I didn't get my item yet. Buttons? Uh, the buttons on this floor usually remove a bunch of rocks, but I don't really need them. So, I, I can just smash rocks myself. <laughs> yeah, that's my follower notification. This is the sound of a coin kind of thing. I don't, that doesn't really bother me. It's all right. Jeez. I think I already lost my deal. I don't know if I really want these. Neither one of them are good. I might as well take the left one, but whatever, it ain't gonna help none.
Man, that gravity boy in that mine. I might be dying and not even know it. They're hiding my health bar. Ah! Fucker put blood on the floor that I didn't see at all. Get him. Mess him up. That was... That was not good, and neither is this. Just a bunch of trash on this floor. Well, here's why I saved my soul hearts, so... Down we go. This floor is awesome. I like this floor a lot. The teleporters are a good idea. If you can't get across normally, you can just do that. A lot of interesting um, mini games built into this floor too, like stealth sections and stuff that are optional and just give you access to another half of the floor. I think just switched places with me. What a jerk! Hey, thanks, Culture Nut. That's a lot of bits. Holy shit, that's a lot of bits. <laughs> Damn. That's that's a hundred and twenty dollars, basically. Small rock. D4. Hmm. Now that's good. That's what I'm looking for right there, folks. So, my books there. What do we get? Tech two. We can do better than that. Suicide King. We don't want that. Uh. Yeah, my damage is not good enough for tech two. Reroll. Tiny planet? I don't think so. My damage isn't bad, though. Let's use this for a while and see if it's um, reasonable or not. I want to say it's not, but we'll see. Make sure. I'm going to say it's not. We'll reroll it. Surely we can get a good build out of this thing, huh? Um, I can get... I can go either to the negative room or to the final boss of this area. Which I haven't done on stream yet, so maybe I will, but... That's quad shot. That's probably what I want to keep. Hmm. <laughs> out our energy. Can we do better than quad shot? Probably, but uh, we'll see. I'll think about it. I need something to go with it. This lanky boy. Ugh. Stop that. Get out of here. Why are you still alive? Do I need to kill the other guy first or what? What's your story? This raid boss, man. Never fought one of those before. The circles that those things output cause fear on me, which prevents me shooting. It's not good. I'm not having any damage at all. I think I'm rolling. I, I just don't hurt hard enough, man. This actually does more damage than what I just had. Which is pathetic, but it's true. I'm having a really hard time winning these fights because of my damage. Come here. Chase me. No. Got him. Oh, I didn't see my extra life. Yeah, that would be a good plan if I do get an extra, extra life again, is to use that Suicide King to great effect. This Cursed Eye, definitely not doing that. It's Proptosis. Ah, fucker. 
There is a small chance that I can roll into something that will kill me instantly, so I gotta I gotta watch that. We need to pick a build and stick with it. This is pretty good. Um for right now. It's not great. I'm not I'm not used to having such weak D4 builds. How many items do I have? I got the soul on right now. Tears up, I might save for later. They're changing my stats so much. If I am re-rolling this. Let me look around a bit. Yuck. Yeah, let's, let's do it. First size back, no thanks. What's this? It's nothing great. I have so many batteries, I might as well try and find something great, right? Or do I try and? <laughs> I like that. That's pretty nice. Buy uh, D4, I think. Farewell. The chocolate milk sickle is pretty nice. I also have the mind. It's just like King kind of blows, honestly. It's barely worth even manipulating it. I'm not too worried about it. Suicide, Suicide King is another example of an atrocious idea. Implementation is just not there. Another Afterbirth special disaster there. Maybe not even Afterbirth. Maybe the Rebirth made that mistake. I don't even remember. It really sucks though. Sometimes you don't even get an item for it. Okay. I mean, is it good for activating Judas Shadow? Because you don't need any help doing that. <laughs> like, I don't need Suicide King to turn that on. I suppose the benefit there is that you might get a Soul Heart for him. Pretty solid. Not amazingly good, but pretty solid sickle shot there. I lost my stompy power. I gotta keep that in mind. So the puzzle this time was just, do you have a bomb? Now we can access the latter half of the stage. So we had a bomb, in fact. check out that super secret room might as well. Eh. <laughs> I haven't talked about that yet, but another thing that Afterbirth seems like it did is ruined all the secret rooms. Son of a bitch. It's chaos card. Interesting. Maybe I should do the final boss and just use that on him. I hate to do that though, uh, since I want to show him off. I hate to use a chaos card and just one-shot him, that's no fun. He's pretty tough, but I mean, if I'm going down there, I would, pro I would prefer to show him off at least a little bit. He's a really neat boss. He's a lot like Mega Stan in many ways. 
Just another boss like that. You have to work pretty hard to get in there, and then when you get there, he's bullet hell boss. Takes a couple tries of damage before he dies, because he's got forms. That shot, man. It just barrels through my fires. All those fires. And manages to clonk me in the head. Amazing. Not having soul hearts is a pretty big downgrade. You can abuse the spacebar items so you could easily become overpowered, but I don't really have a good one right now, so that's actually not true. I'd rather have soul hearts in this case. This book doesn't scale into late game too hot. If I could find something really nice to use instead, it'd be a different story. New boss has two phases. Yeah, that was our optional part of the map. That was the top half. I don't really have a lot of hearts either to fight him with. It's gonna be it's gonna be rough. If I could find like the invulnerability book, that's it. Game's over. If I could just find that one item somewhere. Don't see that happening, so. Drop a couple coins in here, I guess. What about? Yeah, we got another floor. We can still shop. Uh oh. This room's pretty rude. I don't even know what to do. Ow. I don't really understand those warps at all. I should have looked at it first, I guess. Well, there's some health. There's another secret room over here. Greed. We now have free shopping. Yeah, the flames die if they take damage, so I can't just sit on them all game unless I have a bunch of stock. And I do, so I should have. Pretty well. Oh, I haven't seen you fight yet. Actually, I did. I just one-shot him last time, so I didn't get to fight him. We're in for a real battle here. Oh, I've been hooked. <laughs> Ow. Oh, he's buffed up. You're done. I better go grab that heart. I'm sitting on 43 battery power right now, so I could totally abuse any of a million great spacebar items if I could just find one. Just one. What would be the best one? Yum Heart? Probably. I'd be immortal if I found Yum Heart. Or the Book of uh, Shadows. Those would both be insane if I found either one of those. Anything else that's ridiculous um, at full charge would also be nice. This book is pretty inferior compared to a lot of those at this point. It was good at the start, but like I said, it just doesn't scale. 
Here's some useless money. <laughs> Literally pointless money. Pick this up. Let's go in here and do the other half, the, uh, the optional half of this. So the trick here is, can you go in diagonally? Apparently I can't. I should be able to do that, but apparently I screwed it up. Oh well. No big deal. We ain't gonna get our devil deal, that's all. Not that we would've anyway, I'll probably take a hit. I missed it? How'd that happen? I must, uh, yeah, I put it over too far. My goal is to make these sickles as big and ridiculous as I can. Do some more stuff to do that. Let's go on in here. How's my health? I, w I wish I had stuck getting that freaking curse. I just don't have enough health to know if I can even go in there or not. I think I do, but I don't want to risk it. I'm going for it. Whatever. How bad can my health be? That's really dangerous. Eh. We're still alive. Can we get out of here? <laughs> yeah, okay. We probably have like one hit left. This room is not fair. The way they warp is just not obvious. You're gonna take a hit there, man. And I'm gonna have to go back through it now. Shit. Ugh. They killed me. Fucking room. I can't believe I got ruined by that room, man. It's so confusing. So it goes... Let me try and figure this out for next time. It goes... To the bottom right, and then you have to go right again, and then it warps you right again. So it's so weird. Ah, I got ruined by that shitty room. Gotta do another run now. Ain't much making much progress. That's too bad too. We had something good going on. Get shit on by that. Not a big fan of rooms like that that are traps. Crazy asshole traps. They don't really belong in this game. It's really confusing, but I think what you have to do is just keep on going in the direction towards the, the guy shooting at you, which is really unintuitive. I really don't want this. Man. Fuck. I'm restarting. I'm not gonna pick that up. <laughs> I don't like Epic Fetus at all. It's too good. It's no fun. We could just restart till we get something that I like, I guess. Because we uh, seem to be having trouble. Let me do that. Find something with some synergy. No? Hmm. Epic Fetus is an instant win. You can't dodge the shot though, it sticks platforms on the entire thing, you have to do it all in one run. That's how it works, the entire floor gets lit up with those spikes for a long time. See you later, Alan. That's not great. Where's the good stuff at? I should probably head in these curse rooms just to check. Nah. Like, that's much worse than it usually is. Get two soul hearts in there. 
they're really underwhelming for her. <laughs> I normally would be all over that, but uh, not in this case. Dead cat? That's really dangerous. For her, it's extremely bad. How come I'm... <laughs> I only get curse rooms, no... no uh, what's this? Nope. No item rooms, ever. Got the best of both. That's really useless, and this is... Man! It's a, a incredible... I broke it. This game is a little crashy. I don't know if they're gonna patch it to make it crash less. But, um... I've personally only crashed twice. And the, the other time I definitely deserved it. I broke the game in half. Let's see. I haven't played this guy yet. I guess I could try him. What else did I unlock? I unlocked the challenge for him, and whatever this is. Let's try this real quick, break it up. Is this the sword run? Yeah. Huh. Ah, uh, how? How did you get me? <laughs> Through the shield. Jerk. What a son of a bitch. Bam. I don't think we get items, so I'll check, make sure. Sometimes we do. You do it on one of the challenges, but normally you don't get item rooms. Ow. No reason not to look around anyway, because I can use soul hearts this time, so definitely better. Soul hearts are a big help, so battery power is nice, but it's not as good as soul hearts, I think, because you get all those devil deals for them. She needs... She's a pretty tough character to play, actually, despite how good she is in general. I got a problem here. I'm stuck at melee range on a boss that requires range. That, that horse needs to die. want that. Whatever. Maybe I do? I, I think I'd rather play with this for a while. Oh, it doesn't finish? I better quit then. That sucks. How far do I have to go on it? What is the end game for this? What's the goal? Well, it's a fun challenge, it looks like. But uh, if I have to do the entire DLC area thing... Maybe I better back up. Just go back to my Bethany runs. Try and finish this. That sounds rough. Sounds like a hard challenge. Let's do this. Dark chest is not, uh, dark room is not hard at all, so I should just do that real quick. Just knock it out of the way. I forget why I didn't complete it that one time. Oh, it's because I grabbed the wrong picture. Yeah, I had it in the bag. We should have been done with this a long time ago. Then I'll rotate characters. I'll try that new character out some other time. I don't think I'm interested right now. I'm trying to learn a new guy. What do we get? Pretty nice.
Hmm. Can't really escape when your hitbox is that big. Thanks, Tank Man. You too. Goes all my flames, probably. I don't have enough to push you away. You're gonna spam me. Yeah, here he comes. Just stay over there, buddy. Just stay away. Yeah. I have an extra key. That's going down. There's an enemy in here. It's the bucket boy. That down. Man! You a jerk. Something's still alive. Somewhere. There you are. Wow, fuck, man. I just cannot get a devil deal on this stupid character. It sucks. It's really hurting me, man. I, I like her gimmick, but man, I really need a break. These enemies getting shots like that, it's really tough down here. I did not expect them to shoot over that. I really didn't. Her fans are not worth this lack of soul heart action I got going on. It's just it's really hard. They want to say 45%, but I I just didn't get any last time, and it really, it really fucked me up. I really need those. Fortunately, she's uh, very likely to get angel deals. That being soul hearts, it's gonna be bad. Thanks for the bits. Rick, how you doing? I better back up. Nice, that's good. I haven't seen anyone type salt into my chat for like two years. You're the first, congratulations. You've brought back memes. Ah, man, he spawned those on me. I better stay down in the corner. I'm doing all right. Did all my Christmas shopping yesterday. Let me grab another red heart before I head down. Maybe there's a um, way into the store here. Hmm. There is. Give me a key. Yeah, we usually don't use them around here because uh, most of those shitty emotes are very uncreative commentary. Cap is banned already. I never had to be on salt because nobody spammed that one. People spam Kappa though. The most uncreative uh, members of Twitch spam that shit all the time, so I just banned it. <laughs> That's been banned for two years. Ain't got no complaints about that. Uh, 
Uh, where are we going? Big room. I I lost all my flames, but I have triple shots still, so I still have some power. Won't take much to level this thing up. Don't really need this. I don't think I'm going down there this time. Ugh. Hey guys, this is the best team out. I'll take this. Try this. Yeah, Twitch does have a lot of bad emotes, honestly. They flooded them. People like them, I guess. I don't I don't really understand a lot of them. You know what? That's not a bad item for this. Not high quality emotes like my helpy block. You can tell who's bad at Twitch by who spams Kappa when I say Kappa sucks too. All y'all, you suck at Twitch. Bless this guy. Is is that regular haunt? Why is he down here? Isn't aren't we on like floor three? This guy don't belong here. I feel like he's here as an error. He's way too easy for this place. I gotta, I gotta find another bomber. I can't keep going, going. I gotta look for one. It's a mark rock. Not too worried about it. Is it worth buying a bomb for? Though I don't know. If that's true. It might not even be in there, so. We'll just do this and go down the regular route. Yeah, I think that's the problem. All the global emotes are inside jokes that I don't understand at all. The ones that I do understand are usually really annoying. <laughs> I don't know what the Rotten Hearts do. I never figured it out. If you know, go ahead and tell me. I don't mind that spoiler. I got no idea. I thought it was armor or something, but it's not. It, I don't know what the hell it does. Maybe it leaves gas when you die, take a hit or something, some stupid like that. That's my suspicion, is that it's very underwhelming, because I thought it was armor and it wasn't that good. It's less than that. Oh, you're right, it is spawning blue flies. Well, that's incredible, actually. That's really good. That's much better than I thought it was. Let's, um, let's not go in there yet, because I am may be able to get a deal this time if I can bust through an easy floor. Man, we shoot a lot of shots. Flies are great. Uh, spawning flies is always good. Man, there goes my deal. Okay, fine. We'll go ahead and uh, kill the boss anyway. Maybe we'll still get it. I rely on these flames dot uh blocking too much and I keep getting hit because of it. Soy milk triple shot, not too keen on that. Uh maybe I'll think about it. 
I don't see how that could work though. In my favor, I don't see how that would be a good idea. Whatever, I don't care. This game's too easy anyway. Let's get him. I didn't greed. Off we go. Triple shot isn't horrible with it. It helps a little bit make up for the fact uh Yeah, our flies suck now. That's one downside. That's definitely a thing. Did get our deal. That's interesting. That's less interesting. That's stupid. These items are really bad. <laughs> All of them. I'll just use this once, I guess. And then leave. Ah, we're done here. Yeah. Unless I want to go in here. Sure. Why not? All right. Oh, these are both really good, but chocolate milk fixes soy milk. My damage just went to two instead. Yeah, one and a half damage in soy. This is really good. This is actually really good. I'd be better off without it still, but actually, we kind of fixed it. We're gonna be all right. Chocolate milk and soy milk together basically double what soy milk does normally. And then we triple shot that, so we have a bunch of shots that do two or three damage each, constantly flooding out instead of one. Big help. Whoa. Hmm. What hit me? I don't even know. Dead end. Thanks, Space Whaler. The sub. Things are going pretty well here now. Got a lot of damage. Lost my deal again, but that's okay. We're all set. Uh, do I need to? I might as well go shopping. These extra areas give you a ton of money and soul hearts and stuff. I do need some soul hearts to get in the door. I need to stop using them. I forgot about that. I always use them right away, and that's not how this needs to happen, so. I need to find another one, then we'll be good. Nice find there. Trying to protect those rotten hearts. Key piece. Better check for, um, Mark Drox. The floors are so big that you run into some Mark Drox here all the time.
Okay, I got what I needed. Might as well pick up uh, this. Sure. All set. Let's get out of here. How's everybody's Christmas Eve doing? You guys done shopping? Hopefully. Be pretty rough if you're not. I feel sorry for you if you're not. I feel really safe down here. What's, what's up with this fight? Why are there so many rocks in the way of the boss? Can he do other things? Can he get me? I guess he can throw those flies at me. Here he comes. Too little too late, buddy. We got a deal, I think. I heard... Hey! Devil deal, too, somehow. Let me blast that. Um, there's a marked rock here, too. Check out our devil deal before we mess with that door. Really good stuff in here. I'm taking uh, these two. <laughs> Let's check this out. What do you think of that? Pretty nice. All right. Okay, let's go. Just a wall of trash in between me and the enemy here is amazing. That might be hard for you guys to see, but I am shooting a wall of chocolate milk tears, basically. Soy milks, chocolate milk, tears. Charging enemies are worthless against this, but uh, other enemies maybe not so much. Certainly helps me get some damage done though. Now that rosary might help me out some. Not sure. Kill that one first. I don't like him. He's coming this way. He's just not dying. Ah, he threw a bomb bone. There's my full power. Now we're ready. Hey, thanks for the follow. I didn't see who it was, but thank you. I need to get spectral tears on these as well. So I can kind of shimmy them around the objects. Yuck. Couple things in there I would like to buy, I think. It's worse than gland problems. Apparently, those hearts have um, parasites living in them that creates maggots and flies. <laughs> ah! What was that? Super Pen, how you doing? You jerk, out of nowhere. Oh, I, I probably shouldn't have done that since we're maxed out already. Whoops, I, I need to sit on my soul hearts, wasting them.
one of these buttons leads to the floor. There it is. The other ones are fake. That's the gimmick there. Hell yeah. <laughs> that rules. I'm throwing away the ability to find more hearts for this. I don't care. Whatever, we're doing it. Committed. Jerk. I have a pretty good build, so I probably should go to the harder boss, because I really don't feel like Dark Room is that dangerous, and so I'll just do that. But um, I hope I actually succeed. I better pick up that Bible. Get rid of it. Oh my god, what a room. Gross. Let's retreat. Head in here. This in here. Nice. Nice. These are maxed out again. Keep them maxed out. Consistently. Oh, God. You guys want to see the new boss, right? You know, nobody wants me to go to Dark Room, right? I'm just doing it for the purpose of unlocks, but uh, since I can easily win down there. If I do finish the uh, the knife, I'll go there. I think I can. I think I got both pieces. If I, if I didn't, I can't do it. I have to pick up. I have to go through the entire optional zone to do it. And I think I started early enough. I think I get... I'm not sure. Looks like I did. There's brains hopping around over here. Super night. I don't know if I've seen that boss or not. Maybe I have. Swallowed? I don't know. That doesn't sound familiar. I'm weaving these around the <laughs> Take that. Ugh. I'm doing a very good job weaving. But they eventually do fall. I can't do it forever. Oh yeah, I'm opening these. You get what on the mausoleum? No, you have to go through the entire thing. You can't just grab one piece. Only one piece is in the mausoleum. You have to get one in each part. Oh, you mean the new boss. I don't think I've seen it then. I haven't been to the mausoleum very many times. I don't think it works with Brimstone now. Unfortunately. Oh no. He made me lose the game. I've just been soft locked, you see that? Shit. Can I, um. Hmm. Let me, um. Try and cheat the game here. Hold on a second. I'm not giving up until this doesn't work. They really need to fix that. Whoop. That was bad.
Alt F4 to see if this fixes. If not, they ruined my run. Hopefully it does. Good, we're good. We're fine. What a shitty thing to do. <laughs> the Joker. There's an enemy that flips positions with you and he decided to flip me to a place I couldn't get out. That's what happened. Which item do I want to buy? Do I want to buy the key? I don't really need that. How about this thing? Our idiot flies will be slightly better. Not really, but maybe we pretend that they'll do damage, right? We spawn enough of them. <laughs> I'll do something. Make so many, might as well use that. Are you the one who swallows me? <laughs> it's possible I ran into one of these bosses that does that and killed him instantly. I've seen this guy before, he doesn't do anything too interesting. Those are both really nice. Uh, without the Soul Hearts, the pack's a little bit worse, but it's still pretty good. Let's go down. Yeah, down we go. Can you bomb the statue in this mod? That's alright. Maybe next time. I should have saved that for later. I'm gonna end up losing that. Whoops. This floor is too dangerous to be picking that up. Let's not forget that I got wiped out with a really good build by some shitty room in this mess. Really bad room. Ugh. Try this out. That's a reroll. Um, garbage ones. That one doesn't help much. And thanks, bits, for the for the bits. Charity bits. I don't know what that thing on the right is, so I'm obligated to take it. The thing on the left is boring. A flamethrower, nice. That's pretty good. And that there is more spacebar items, right? And that's good. I think I'm gonna grab the no curses thing too. So I have a curse on right now that I don't like. <laughs> See you later. Curse. Really good item here. I don't know how it procs exactly. What's what's it doing? Oop. What I... Seems like it procs an awful lot. Good enough to call out a flamethrower. Really nice little item. Is it because of soy milk that's so good? Well, there, there's a soy milk synergy then. That rules. I wouldn't even know. I've never had it without it. <laughs> I guess it. I guess it is because of soy milk. It wouldn't make much sense otherwise. Zero luck in soy milk is causing this much fire. Imagine what a little bit of luck up would be. Hmm. 
I'll take this. <laughs> sure. Why not? Nothing else to buy. That report card trinket's better on somebody who's not this character, I would say, because it's so hard to protect her. She just has no blues. She's gonna end up losing it. Do you lose it when you take blue heart damage? You probably do, actually. So maybe she's really good for it. Can't go in that curse room, I'll lose my heart, and I'm more interested in that than a chance at items. Come back, ghost. Goodbye, ghost. Oh no, not you. <laughs> Got him. I think I was just really weak the first time. He just would not die last time. Is my knife done? I can't even see it. Yeah, it is. I got it. We're gonna do the optional boss. The uh, DLC boss, I guess I should say. Instead of Dark Room. We're on our way now. I think we're ready. Yeah, we're... Good. Yuck! Kick my ass. There goes my extra heart. Take this just in case I screw it up somehow or whatever. Krampus, how you doing? Coal is really nice. Okay, the knife unlocks this. We jump right to Mom's heart. That causes um, this a little bit of mayhem. There we go. Okay, I'm tempted to use that Joker right now. I think I will. Let's just do it. Soul hearts for him. Neat little scam. I like the sack dagger a lot. I don't think I need it though. Um, like I'm gonna pass. I don't think it has much use when I have this much fire spinning around me. So just keep it going. I have four flies generated all the time, and uh, one of them is from the fly baby. So he'll make multiple room. These things are disgusting. I ran into a really nasty trap room based on these last time I was here. Not a huge fan of the lightning totem. Bleh. I have controlled tiers, like all my tiers are controllable with soy milk. That's what I've got going on, something like that. I don't think there's much to explore. I might be wrong, but I don't think there is. Let's jump on in. Rock cut. He's dead. We're too strong for his own good. Don't swallow me. Oh, maybe this is the boss you're talking about. Okay, yeah, I haven't seen this yet. How you doing? Too bad you're, uh, I'm gonna let him shoot. I'm gonna see what he does. Neat. That's pretty cool. Too bad you're dead. Man, what a ridiculously good boss. <laughs> What's this? Tears of shot speed. Nice. Oh, it's too bad I took that de uh, devil deal. I didn't need it. There we go.
yeah, bosses like that, compared to Afterburst shitty bosses, <laughs> you can see why I say this is better. That boss kicked ass. That's how it's done. Hit all the right notes. Too bad I'm too strong for him. Didn't really get to play him this time. That's my fault. Whoop. I mean, you should be allowed to get too strong for bosses anyway. That's better design than having them scale. Where's this heart? There it is. This is the last floor, uh, I think. I think this next boss, the optional one, DLC boss, is coming up. This is Corpse 2. Bleh. I need to try and get my flame spill back up, but I got plenty of hearts to power them up myself. I hate to waste them now because I can get damage off of the ones that are in front, so I can at least do that. The evil hearts I stacked up will proc when I cast them with this book. We'll be going in now. I kill that last uh, turret. Pain in the ass. Easier said than done. There he is. Got him with the fire I left behind. Last call. Delicious. I don't know what that does. Greetings. The camera here is probably the best thing of all. Like, they figured out how to zoom out and they needed to. Oops, stepped in creep. No reason to stop firing, I don't know why I did. I was sad to interrupt that great ass song, but uh, we, we do need to win, so. Take that, sucker. What do you get for bombing the corpse? You get something? I didn't even try. No unlock for that? Interesting. I guess I don't have to do that on everyone. I didn't get nothing for it. Well, we're gonna do um, the regular run that I skipped this time. <laughs> so let's get that underway. Back to Bethany for the last time. For a while, anyway, that I'm playing her. We should be able to pull this off in one go. Pretty easy. Okay, we're rocking a uh, pretty good loadout already with the fires, anyway. Need to find some items. So the black hearts cause fear shot. You're right. I don't know if I like fear very much, but uh, we do get it, so like it or not, it's on. Bethany's okay. Uh, our not having soul hearts is pretty rough, though. Not as rough as some of the other characters, obviously, but... um. So hard stuff takes away all your deals, and that hurts. I need a bomb for that mark rock if I care. Homing shot, no thanks.
<laughs> Your spam is blocked anyway. Whatever. None of those kappas appeared, I'm sorry. You failed. I really like the OST, I'm totally buying this after the stream, I gotta remember to do that. Head over there and buy the other OST, cause it's really good, I really like the final boss song that was playing. But all these songs are hitting the right notes for Isaac, they're all right on point with what they should sound like. Reminds me of the first mix from McMillan's, uh, first game, what, what, who was the, uh, Danny B, I think he was, the one who did that? It reminds me of that set, and I like that set better. This flies are really annoying. Man, they got destroyed by this build. I'm, they're probably the most dangerous thing in here for me. I have a really hard time with them. They uh, they just get obliterated by this barrage I'm firing. They're cancelled. Completely cancelled. Uh-oh. Ah! Dropped a worm on my head. Let's see if we get our deal. Oh no, not you. This guy's kind of a jerk. We have what we need to lock him up at least. We did get our deal, so we got lucky. We got really lucky. Two health up pills, wow. Nice. No, I mean, I banned the emote. They don't show up. We don't see them. You're just typing asterisk. But now you're getting banned because you're a dumbass. <laughs> see ya. Uh, what else did I get here? Do I want to I guess I should, I should look for keys. Sumo. Hey, it's Sumo Boomer, how you doing? Yeah, this mod kicks ass. I love it, Sumo Boomer. It's really good. I need a bomb, no. That's too bad. The only problem with the name anti the anti anti birth name is pretty funny, but um people seem to be misreading it as afterbirth a lot. They think it's just a mod. Uh, they don't think it's a mod, they think it's like content built by him. It's not the same game. Well, hopefully we're in store for a bunch of new mods like this, because I'll play this damn game all the time if they make mods like this all, all over the place. This probably take forever to finish. I don't know how many people were working on this or for how long, I don't know. I only heard about it the day it came out. I saw somebody playing it. One of my buddies speedruns this game was playing it. Hmm.
This character uses soul hearts for battery power. That's how she works. Doesn't get soul hearts. Instead, stalks them away, and I can use the book here that I have as many times as I want. And the book creates a flame that shoots basic tears and takes damage, blocking damage for me, generally. I can have up to 16 of those. They're pretty nice. <laughs> Triple shot again. That. Bleh. What's this? Oh, it's Bucket Boy. Ah. Yeah, I, I, I seriously doubt you're gonna see a lot of mods of this caliber. It probably is gonna be the best one that ever exists, but uh, maybe. I don't know. It's probably gonna be a while before you see something like this come along again. It's really good, but um, it does take a lot of creativity and a lot of time to create any of this stuff. Crazy quiet, hey, thanks for the sub. <laughs> I don't know, that's why I don't see anybody. Anyway, yeah, thanks for the sub. You're number uh, 270 right now. Getting up there. I want to keep it at 250. We've definitely achieved that. Around here. Yeah, 500 is next. I'd like to hit it next year, I'm not too worried about it though. I didn't push for subs until Twitch Prime came out, and then I got a ton. Ah. I always push for my Patreon. But my Patreon is also doing really well, so whatever. Let's <laughs> just... Either way, they're both good. I am interested in getting my sub count out. I wouldn't mind having some more emotes, but I'd also like to sit on 500 for a while anyway. That's a pretty high tier, man. That's pretty, that's pretty gross up there. That's a lot of subs. I've seen Isaac Overhaul mods before. I think God Mode was the one I saw. They're not bad. I didn't expect it to be this good. Like that's what I expected was one that was like that. It it was interesting, but it wasn't. It was barely worth showing off. It wasn't new monsters and stuff and it wasn't that great. It was okay. Uh-oh. Oh! It's, uh, these guys are tough. These guys are really brutal. I feel like this is harder than the mausoleum place. This zone right here, this water zone, is pretty mean. What is my, um, last pickup? Did I get lard on this floor? Or not? I did. Well, since we got hit anyway, what's in here? Red hearts, man. This guy kicks ass. This boss rules. 
I'm still learning him though. The reflections make this a harder fight than I feel like it is. I don't think he'd be that bad if I could see. <laughs> little, I get confused by that. Definitely an interesting way to make him tough. My power's too strong for him though. I got bombs for this, so. <laughs> Banning the Kappa emote is an easy way to get rid of 90% of the unfunny stuff that Twitch chat says. When you can't use it, you are forced to try and be a little bit more creative. It's an extremely uninteresting way to talk. the same joke every time. So we banned it. I mean, I just blacklisted it. That's all I had to do. Ah! I gotta get used to some of these, uh, revenge patterns. I'm gonna look forward to playing the other characters and getting devil deals again. <laughs> it's gonna be nice. Ow! Shit, man. This guy's rough, champion boy. Yeah. I have lost my um, my flame power here. It's really. Weakening me quite a bit. I need to get that back in if I can. I can get seven of them right now, but do I really want to do it right now? I think if I go below four hearts, I'm gonna just kick them all on. Just throw them all on. Yuck. Murdered man. Getting torn to pieces. Yeah, I unlocked that Jacob guy. I haven't played him yet. You beat him by you beat the witness and you get him, yeah. Humbling bundle is really nice. I want that. Ah, man, these things. These wisps, wisps that turn into bombs. He's summoning them. These things need to stop that. <laughs> I got one. No, I didn't. I thought I got him with that bomb, but he moved out of the way. When they fire, they jump backwards. Get out of here. Got him. What a jerk. Got him. Okay, strength cards, a free heal and some damage. I'll use that later. I need to find a couple coins because I really want that humbling bundle. That would really add up to some healing. Not to mention I get a ton of charges off of it. It'll double all of things. <laughs> I 
I gotta deal with one of these problems needs to be solved. Either the digging guys or these cards need to go away. The digging guys seem like they're gonna be the ones. My fire, no. I feel so weak without it. I don't really want either one of these. Gotta be honest, uh, I don't really want him at all, but I'll take him. Maybe he'll add up. I'm not gonna let him get any coins until I have my humbling bundle, though. Uh, this room is a little bit outrageous, because this thing shoot diagonally. Got Zillin, thanks for the sub, buddy. Merry Christmas. Um, I was gonna say, if you're new to this channel, you should check out my arcade pit show that I normally do every Sunday night at 8 EST, but uh, I'm not doing it on Christmas, so you'll have to come back on the 1st. If you know Sky Bills from AGDQ or Author Blues, I'm having them on Sunday on the 1st, January 1st, to do it. I don't know who the other team's gonna be, though, but it's a 2 on 2 show. If you like Nick Arcade, it's basically that, if you remember that show. I can't see in here, this is disgusting. I am dying. Yeah. Still an enemy. Really dark. It's too bad I don't have my fire on because it lights up the room. Looks uh looks clear. I don't think that the um, secret room can be that one. Probably up here. Nope. We have enough bombs to get the humbling bundle now, so that's gonna save my life. And if I can get that bracelet, I will, but I doubt it. I need to get exactly 15 so that I can... You son of a bitch! I forgot about him. Yeah, I shouldn't have picked him up. He's an asshole. Ruining my stuff. My, my plan is corrupted by his greediness. I missed it. <laughs> I got it. I'm gonna get that bracelet too. That's... Got it. You didn't take that one from me, you jerk. But we now get double heal. This boss is... Immortal, but his minions... Do damage to them when they die. Oh, almost. Nice pick up. Oh, jeez. Lost another heart on the way out. Okay, I think we're good here. Let's jump on down.
No, half hearts are. Hey, how come Humbling didn't double that? Well, whatever. Um, half hearts are half hearts. That thing, that thing reverses my controls. So I have to watch it when I get hit with that. God, God, what an enemy, man! What a nasty, gross boy. I don't know if I'm gonna make it if I don't just go in, all in on my flames at this point. It's getting pretty gross. I am getting a little bit of heals. I wanna do it. Let's commit. Try and survive here. It's hell, it's hell that is the mines for some reason. I'm just getting trashed in here. This helps a lot. I'll pick that up now. that. Yeah, I don't want that. Oh yeah, you get all Sundays off? Nice. <laughs> I'm not doing one Christmas Day, sorry. No plans for that. It's actually the first Sunday in a long time I've skipped. And then I'm skipping the... Um, I guess it would be the 8th or 9th. I'm skipping that Sunday too for MAGFest. I'll be at MAGFest. That's gonna eat up my uh, my week. I'm lost. I don't have a map and I don't know where to go. Here we go. Yuck. Need to stay in the safe spots here. If you're going to Magfest, make sure you stop and say hello. I'll be running around all over the place. Maddie also is going to Magfest. It's right before AGQ. Uh, people going to Magfest will go straight to AGDQ. I gotta make sure I say hello to all this, folks. Hey, expensive gamer, how you doing? Have you tried this mod yet? Cause, damn, it's good. If you like Isaac, uh, definitely the good stuff going on here in this this mod. Lots of neat ideas. I want red hearts, not blue hearts. I don't really need blue hearts on this character at all. I have enough flames going on that I don't actually want to find more. I want to find reds. You generally only get one, and if I'm not mistaken, I might be mistaken, but I think that that causes less red hearts to appear, and that's not good. I'm already injured real bad. I've been injured this whole time. I just cannot seem to find any heals. Uh, I don't know about the hotel for Magfest or whatever. I ended up going for one that's 10 minutes away. That's what I had to do. Cheaper anyway, whatever. Save some money. I can drive 10 minutes, I'll be all right. When I say cheaper, I mean like half price. Like <laughs> 70 bucks a night, much less than uh, 150 for a room per day. Come here, you. My fires took some unfortunate damage there. Yeah, I quit playing even after Birth came out. I absolutely s s despised it. It was gross. I finished it recently and complained the entire time. And we've been running Hush for fun because I'm an idiot. But um, this mod is so much better than After Birth. It's crazy.
I'm not even in the my the parts. Of, I don't really like this area too much. I'm not even in the parts of the game I like that much. I'm still having a pretty good time with these new enemies and stuff. The next zone is the one I really like, and the bosses are crazy good. All the bosses have been pretty good. Ow! Come on up. Did I get my item on this floor? I'm gonna check. What do I want here? Ah, uh, that other one creates peepers for soul hearts, basically. Just in the one room. I don't think I should take that. I've made a ton of money off Afterbirth 2 and I still say it sucks. If Northern Lion thinks it's not bad, he's got bad opinions. What do you say to that? <laughs> like, that, I don't see how you can defend Afterbirth at all. It is loaded with bad things. It's absolutely abysmal. There's not much that's good about it at all. I don't understand how anyone could like it. Unless you like really tedious fights and uh, grinding in your um, your shmups, I don't know, because that's a thing. It does. It absolutely does that. It does that to death. It does give you some nice um, combination attacks, at least. That's the primary selling point. More combos, more merges. Damn it! I gotta catch this worm with a bomb. Hopefully this time. There we go. You're done now. Uh, we can. We didn't save any soul hearts. Whoops. Uh, can I go buy some? I don't. I don't think I can. I'm done for. Gotta go down the normal route. No, I don't mean just Hush. I mean everything about Afterbirth is bad, pretty much, except for the synergies. The one thing... Like, some of the best things about Afterbirth are that they fixed bugs that they refused to fix forever. What the hell? What? How's this work? Oh no. Too bad it doesn't stack onto the room. Ooh. <laughs> I'll wait. There's a lot of bad things in Afterbirth, like, um, yeah, I'm screwed, by the way. I'm, I'm dead. There's no way I'm gonna win with this. How am I gonna, how am I gonna blow this up without killing myself? <laughs> Just by muscle memory, you know, tight. Ugh. I hate this. Um. I'm trying to complain about a game here. Can you stop waving me around? Um. Pills were ruined. He added a bunch of pills that don't do anything. 
Like literally nothing. One of them makes you take a full heart of damage for one room if you use it, and the other one does the opposite. That's already useless half the game, because half the game you take a full heart and the other half you don't. So already, that pill does nothing half the time. And then you divide it by that it's only for one room. And then the, you then for have you therefore have two pills that do nothing in the pool. There's like six more just like that that do nothing. So the pill pool is ruined. Oh, I found a way to make the dark room run hard, huh? Oink. All the new content is really badly done, just because it scales. Ah, oh, no! I think it's starting to wear off. It looks a little bit less impactful now. Oops, I didn't think I was in front of him. I actually did pretty well with that effect on, to be to be honest. I didn't get hurt by it as much as I thought I would. My fire. Damn. Damn! You got me. It definitely boosted my tier rate significantly. That part's gone. You gotta keep in mind I have triple shot, and also I have these other things shooting, so it's hard to see my actual tears. For a while there, it was really high. We're almost back to normal. Please, first. Ugh. An envy enemy. Killed all my fires. Every single one. I gotta sit on these for a while and try and get them back. <laughs> the worst curse of the maze ever. I, uh, this room I hate is back. Oh, you know what? Let's just blow this one up. Nice! Finally, I got healed. It took me forever. And Rainbow Poop is what does it, of all things. Usually that's worthless. I'm loaded now. 12 hearts? I ain't gonna lose. It's over. This is gonna take forever, but it's, it's over. I'm gonna crush the dark chest. I really want that battery. I want it enough that I'll, I'll steal some coins from this. We do have double coins anyway, so... That jerk took my- I really shouldn't have picked him up. He's such an ass. Pick a charge. It's gonna give us a ton of these. Every room we're gonna be using this. So we're, we're gonna max this out real soon. Let's go ahead and just use them all, I guess. Full power, no time.
Grab the right one this time. Take this. Yeah, adding three choices to the gutter makes them a lot better, doesn't it? Decisions make this game a lot better. Not being locked into the same route. You know what? I'm gonna blow him up. Give this guy some coins, I guess. Is that a tough fight, beating a witness with them? I haven't even tried them yet. What's this? Nice, not bad. My full circles, we got it. That's the power of that battery. Work right there. Jerks. I'm killing them all. Can't do much about it though, I just not dying. I have to rebuild them. My circles. Run by these shifty teleporter boys. Where is he? Hmm. Let's go right. Isaac's heart's always bad, yeah. There's no way to make it good. You can you can like scam one worthless thing in the um coin machine, but that's it. The donation machine. That's really not very helpful, honestly. <laughs> it's not worth the price that it breaks everything. It has no synergy at all. Well, these guys ruined my flames. It's really hard to keep those flames alive against some enemies. No deal. Bloody last. Let's grab our hearts.
Okay. <laughs> I'm just not doing any damage with this. All I have really is triple shot and some couple damage ups. It's really not very good. Thankfully, uh, all we're doing is the lamb, so that should be easy enough. Finish unlocking this character at least down here. Man, these guys are jerks. I wish I hit harder. Still my coin. What an ass. Alright. I guess it's okay. I don't need coins anyway. I actually do need one of those hearts. We might as well go down to the uh, Sheol with uh, full health, eh? Does this trinket make the bean items better? Because that totally blasted him. A bean booster. Yeah. Karatoma in the dark. I'm gonna go grab some hearts and then we'll go down. If you got the IV bag with, um, the red penny thing that makes hearts when you pick up coins. That's the only situation really I can think of where you might have some kind of scam going. It ruins a lot of scams single-handedly though, so you better have that one going or else it's actually gonna hurt you no matter what. It's bad too, but it also ruins a bunch of cheats. Uh, situations where you can get infinite items and stuff, it ruins them. He's giving me pills, I like that. Bump friend, you help me out. I don't like that pill. Shit. Head on here. Missed one. Okay. When we actually go into the uh, dark room, I'll use all these. Save them for. Uh, I don't want Stan stepping on my fires. This music rules. Come on, Lokes. 
Out of the corner. Out of the corner. I just cleared that corner. Pretty disgusting enemy. I'm not too happy to see these ever. Don't think they should have been thrown in. Yeah. I might be pretty hurt. I'm not sure. I might have lost like half my hearts already. I'm trying to find this. Bum friend might give me some hearts back, maybe if I'm lucky. That's better than what I have. It's range up. <laughs> I think that brim boy. He'll never get through this. Sorry. Time for the Z move. Let's check what our health actually is at. I wonder if they added any new uh, intro stage animations. That is a lot of pills. That's good. <laughs> Range up HP down. Don't really like that one. Oh well. Let's find this guy. Ugh, I hate these enemies, man. Gross. So strong. Really don't have much power at all. Hopefully we can get this guy to drop me a heart. Yeah, I know it has a new title screen. Atherbus sucks. This has got nothing good about it. Anyone who says otherwise, I don't. I don't even know where their opinions are coming from. Like, there's difference of opinion, and then there's just being wrong. I don't know. You you must really like weird, shitty mechanics if you like Atherbus, like grinding. Some people do like to grind, and I can understand it in an RPG, but not in this game. Unlocking that stuff was the worst. Greed mode is not very good either. Like, it would be fine if it was built in a proper way, but it wasn't. After Antibirth is harder than Afterbirth. Afterbirth is a joke. Nothing in Afterbirth is hard. They tried to make a shitty lost character in an attempt to make something hard. He's not hard either. That guy that starts with triple shot and lives on coins for no reason. Just one one hit challenges are not very creative. Okay, we got a full circle. Wish I could give the quarter to that guy, but maybe we'll get a bunch of money off of Super Greed. There you go, buddy. Hook me up. Give me five hearts. Come on. <laughs>
That's what I want to see. Not so great. Luck up, speed down? Okay, whatever. My speed is 0.68. That's actually really bad. I'm not fast enough to dodge anything. Let alone homing brimstone. Here's my boss. Let's kill a couple fatties. Yeah. <sighs> so slow. Well, whatever. Boss time. He's floating this way. <laughs> I can't evade those with my... F obviously, impossible to dodge this with this. I mean, I don't take damage, but I, I cannot guard my fire from him. Nor can I use bombs, ever. I could just ram into him with these, and they'd probably do a ton of damage to him. They do pretty good damage. Yuck. Pretty good character, Bethany, but I'm not gonna miss you. <laughs> I'm not gonna s come back and play you anytime soon. I'm gonna finish the other characters. Glad that this is officially done. You are dead. Alabaster box. Alright. Well, I'm going to call it for now. I was just doing a stream to make up for the fact that I did not stream last night. We were supposed to do Video Game Jeopardy. Did not make it. We finished a character, though, on this, so that's good. Uh, I will probably be on tonight doing challenges for the show. I don't know what else I'll do. I am doing a marathon on Monday. I'm not doing a stream Sunday. At least not Arcade Pit. Usually do, but not this Sunday. Let me find somebody to raid, if you feel like joining me in that. I'll find somebody who's doing something. Let's see. Seeing anyone on actually. That's weird. Too early? There's no sleep cycles, nothing. How's retro look? Not even retro game in line. Nobody around. Okay, well, I'll just find somebody to host. I'll see you later. Some random guy I'm gonna end up with. Thanks for the bits on the way out. <laughs> see you later. Merry Christmas.